Vlon is always gifting 100 subs. Everyone at Vlon right now say thank you. Uh, Nick's lost. It doesn't matter, Uzi. Nick's in six, dumbass. Nick's in six, dumbass. Nobody just went out. Fire, fire, fire. How many viewers did we got? How many viewers did we got? Listen, bro. RJ is going crazy. You got to give the ball to Derrick Rose, though, bro. I'm going to tell you guys the truth right now. Derrick Rose is the best person on the Knicks. I, and, 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 and look, man, I know you guys say I don't know basketball and shit, but Derrick Rose is the best. He's the best player on the Knicks. And it's just a fact. You know what I mean? It's just a fact. Um, you got to get the ball to Derrick Rose, bro. You got to get the ball to Derrick Rose. You got to let him do his thing. You know, he has, yeah, he's just a demon, bro. He's a demon. Um, thank God the Knicks are in the playoffs for the first time in years, bro. Literally like 10, almost 10 years, bro. It's crazy. Um, obviously, you know, we had Melo and, and, you know, that's, it's crazy. Julius Randle doesn't exist. He's, he's amazing. Him and RJ, they're all crazy, bro. But Rose is, come on, it's Derrick Rose, bro. You know what I mean? So, look. All my noties are out. Thank God. Thank you, Uzi. Noties are out. Point in his chat. The Knicks almost had that win. They could beat the Hawks. Uh, obviously, when I was saying fuck Trey Young, I, I, Trey Young, I was just kidding. Um, uh, I did not mean that. I love everybody. Uh, I don't want any problems with Trey Young at all. Knowing that my how weird my community is sometimes. Let's tweet at Trey Young a bunch of clips and be saying that. Yeah, yeah. Fucking weirdos, bro. I'm at the point where I came and fucking say fuck somebody. I was literally trolling, bro. Like, I have no problem. Uh, Takashi FaceTimed me today. If you guys don't know Takashi, he's a 6'9". Uh, I, he's, he's not the person I, uh, who dissed me. Uh, I will pull the video up of who dissed me. He's a rapper. Or she's a rapper. He or she's a rapper. Um, but Takashi called me, bro. Takashi hit me up. Um, I'm debating whether I want to do a Takashi stream or not. You guys are saying Cap. I'll call him right now. Yeah, I have his personal number. Um, I don't know if I want to do it, though. Do we do this or not? Do we do this shit? I can have him come to LA. I can have him come to LA. Yeah, do a poll. Do a poll. I don't know. He'll, 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 he'll probably call me back. Do a, do a poll real quick if you guys want 6 9 on my stream. I want everyone to vote. He actually called me today. Like, I, it was crazy. Um, no people are going to stop messing with you? I don't think so. I don't think so at all. Um, he just texted me and said, I'm on my way. What does that even mean? Um, what the fuck does that even mean? Chat, we're, uh, we're at 59,000 subs, I think, on Twitch. Yeah, we're at 59,200 subs. Uh, if you guys got Amazon Prime, Twitch Prime, click subscribe right now. You guys can sub for free. Uh, at 60,000 Twitch subs. Um, I'm going to be doing a hot tub stream with Summer Ray. Uh, it's going to go fucking crazy. Yeah, J Money, exactly. We're about to pull that shit up. Um, we uh, we uh, we got to go over who dissed me, though, bro. I got to pull up this shit. We're mad close to the, the sub goal, though, chat. Like, I'm telling you, we can hit this stream for sure, for sure. Uh, so you guys want 6 9 it's a 76-24 poll. Let me tell you guys why 6-9 on my stream would not do anything. I'm not going to be his boy. Uh, it's kind of like how Impulsive had 6-9. Or it's kind of like how Adam22 had 6-9. Honestly, I don't talk about what he did was wrong or right. He's a fucking rat at the end of the day. You know what I mean? And you could tell him I said that. He will fucking see it. 6-9, if you call me back right now, I will call you a rat on the phone, bro. You're a rat. See, I'm really about that shit, bro, chat. I, I don't snitch. I'm not a snitch. I've never been the type to snitch. As you guys know, if I ever got locked up, why are you guys saying L boyfriend? W what is that? Why? Oh, hot tub stream with summer. L boyfriend. L boyfriend, right? Shut the fuck up, bitch. Fucking bunch of 10, 11 year olds in this bitch. Um, so look, I'm going to tell you guys right now, uh, when, when it comes to the, uh, the snitching shit, I don't do that, bro. You guys know me if, uh, you know, uh, that's just how I am, bro. I've always been about that shit. Like, if I say some shit and I mean it, like, I just, I don't, I don't go down that shit. I don't do that shit, bro. Um, I, I'm not one to snitch. I'm not one to tell. I just don't do that shit. Um, did you update your teeth yet? Ha 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 ha. You're so funny. Um, man, stop acting like you hard, bro. S I L V U H. At Silva in the chat. I'm hard, bitch. I'm literally hard. Now, nah, for real though, bro. I, I, I'm not the type to snitch though. Um, for real though. Uh, but let's, uh, let's, uh, let's fucking, uh, let's, uh, how you guys gonna say cat, bro? Anyways, like I said, chat, we're already at 59,300 subs. 
700 subs away for a hot tub stream with summer um i want to get it locked in before june 1st um i got a lot of shit going on bro i'm going to miami charity book my flights i'm going to miami in june i'm going to both fights i'm going to mayweather and i'm going to logan uh i uh i got tickets i paid for tickets for the logan fight because i don't think i would have gotten hooked up um at all for that one but the tiktok one i, I luckily i'm Thank God for you guys. I was able to ease my way in there, uh, get in the low, uh, the TikTok one. So that's confirmed. Um, so I'm going to both fights. Uh, we'll be collaborating with a bunch of rappers that live in Miami. Um, and yeah, I'm really stoked. Hey, take take Dom. Thanks for the tank. Get this up, motherfucker. I appreciate you. Mayweather and Logan, the same thing. That's not what I meant. I meant Mayweather versus Logan, and then I'm going to the fucking TikTok versus YouTubers. My fault. That's what I meant. Um... That, that's what I meant, bro. My bad, 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 my bad. <laughs> um, you said the fight is going to be a good vlog. Exactly, yeah, 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 exactly. I, 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 you know, it's going to be dope. Uh, let's talk about the Lakers really quick. As you guys know, the Lakers almost lost that fucking game. That shit was crazy. Um, LeBron, thank God he's all right. I know he landed horribly on his fucking elbow. Uh, they'll get him next game for sure. Um... Um, they did lose. No, I know they did. I know they did. The Lakers lost. I know. Did you go to Adrian's kickback? No, 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 no. Uh, I did not go to Adrian's kickback. Tomorrow's video is going to be probably just a normal vlog. Um, but, uh, I got, I got, uh, I got, a. um, there's something in the, in tomorrow's vlog that's going to be funny as fuck that you guys will see. Uh, yo, RB Lewis, thanks for the five good subs, bro. Appreciate you. It doesn't matter, chat, that the, uh, the Lakers lost. Cause you guess what? The Lakers are going to win the next four games in a row. It doesn't fucking matter. Uh, so I don't give a flying fuck. Um, but yeah, le I, that's all I gotta say. Hey, I'm gonna let you guys know right now, if you guys keep doing chants, uh, you're gonna literally lose your mod. So Royce, you have a warning. Um, you're gonna lose your mod. Everyone gets one chant an hour. If you keep chanting, you are 100% losing your mod. Just letting you know right now. Um, Royce, you're ugly as fuck. Uh, you put on a face cam, you're literally disgusting. Um, and yeah, Let's see something real quick. Oh, that's what's good. Yo, chat, we got uh, Karan Mayweather in the stream right now. Uh, yo, Karan, I'm letting you know right now, you're watching me, bro. If, you're, if your dad loses the fucking fight, boxing is fucking rigged. There's no way Floyd loses the fucking fight. If he loses, bro, this shit is rigged as fuck. I'm putting all money on fucking Floyd. If I lose my fucking money, I'm going to be very upset, bro. That's all I'm saying. Um... Karan, please tell me that you can fucking uh, secure this. Also, uh, Karan, I, I don't know if there's anything you could do about it, bro, but uh, I paid for tickets. You know, I, I, I'm not really connected in, in the boxing force. Um, if there's any way that you know about a way to upgrade my tickets, that'd be fan-fucking-tastic. If not, all, all good. Um, but yeah, I, uh, I, 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 either way, I'm, I'm going to the fight. Uh, my, tick, my seats aren't the best, but it's, it, it's whatever. Um, but uh, I usually do bet on the underdogs, but... Um, I was literally told today by Zia's that uh, there's no fucking way Logan wins. So, yeah. Um, w bag, Aiden. Nah, look, man. Um, Karan is going to get into Twitch. And uh, that'd be, I will try, bro. Hey, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. And, uh, you know, we're going to link regardless. So, he said, I'll try. Don't worry. Oh, very nice of you. Uh, uh, May w Mayweather's in the chat. Uh, you guys are very awesome family. Uh, you're all very handsome. Um, oh, he said, if I can't let you know, okay, cool. You're all very handsome, very attractive. Um, I love all the Mayweathers. You guys are great people. Um, and yeah. All right. I want to react to the dish, bro, because I know we got a hundred thousand people in here. Let's react to this shit. We're doing a scary game chat tonight. Uh, so we got scary game to do. We got reactions, uh, text to speech. I might get a haircut today. I need one of the next tomorrow or the next day for sure. Royce, I swear to God, if you do it again, you're losing your mom. On God. So, try me, bitch. You fucking soft pussy-ass bitch. I'll beat the fuck out of you. Call your barber? All right, let's see. Yeah, I'll call him. I'll call him. I'll call him. Let's see if he wants to do it tonight. Uh, here we go. Uh, also, I got to tell you guys a really fucked up story. Um, it happened to me this morning. So, two kids showed up. You guys know I don't like to use the word fans. Two supporters... Two family members showed up. They came to my fucking door. These kids are wearing sunglasses and fucking suits and ties. So I'm getting my food. Me and Pammy ordered food. I'm going outside to get my fucking food. 
I go pick up the bag of food. This dude literally walks up to me with his friend. It's a picture of a guy getting fucked in the ass by another guy. And my face is on it, bro. So I'm here like, what the fuck are you doing? Pammy doesn't feel well. So I wanted to go back inside with her and give her the food. You guys are laughing. Like, it's actually like I was actually like weirded out. Can I just tell you? Hold on, hold on, hold on. So anyways, I, I, I go to fucking, uh, I'll be like, one second. Let me just go serve the food and I'll come right back outside. So I come right back outside and uh, uh, they asked me to sign the picture. And then they say, can you keep it? I said, no, I don't want to keep the picture. I signed it. They took a picture with it. <laughs> um, and uh, the picture will probably surface. It's, it's fucking insane, bro. Um, hey, guys, I love you guys so much. But to show up at my house when I just wake up and, and, and get a butt-ass naked picture of me on that shit, it's, it's just a little bit fucking out of, out of pocket. You know what I mean? Um, I would appreciate if you guys, you know, didn't show up here. Uh, and, uh, you signed it, LOL. Okay, I didn't want to be mean, bro. Uh, they were wearing fucking suits and ties, which was hilarious. That was funny as fuck. Um, I didn't go to Adrian's kickback. No, 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 I didn't go. I didn't go to that. Uh, guys, uh, Mr. Mayweather said you're all handsome, uh, and you're handsome too, Aiden. We should fuck. We should have, you should, you, we, we should get married and then I'll, I'll have the last name Mayweather and then we could fuck. I'm just kidding. No, I'm actually literally just kidding. I swear to God, I have a girlfriend. Go to my Instagram, bro. Her name is Pammy Baby. I swear in my life, I have a girlfriend, bro. I don't actually mean that. She's not a cover-up either. On God, she's not. Um, wait, is he actually a minor? Twenty-one. You guys are fucking weird, bro. Oh my god, I got so scared. Holy fuck, I got so scared. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. He's twenty-one. Thank God. Oh my god, that was so scary. Anyways, um, you guys got me with that. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. You guys got me with that. Um. Who's the rapper that dissed you? We're going to watch the whole video, bro. Hey, there's a whole video on it, bro. Um, Aiden, what's the whole stream going to be about? We're going to watch some videos, react to stuff, uh, do an IQ test maybe. Uh, chat, the sponsorship hit me back about uh, giving away money to people who deserve it. Uh, I kind of want to do maybe some Discord shit today. I'm not going to gamble today. Um, you guys are kind of getting sick of gambling streams. I've been listening feedback and shit. Just not really that much to do. SSB World New York, uh, I said I was going to drop this weekend. Didn't have time to drop it this weekend. Uh, let's try to drop it June 1st. Yo, Fanta Jack, thanks for the five gifted subs. I appreciate you, bro. Remember, chat, 60,000 uh, Twitch sub. We are going to um, we are going to do a hot tub stream with Summer. Um, and yeah. Where's Tory Lanez? Let me call him up real quick and see if he wants to slide. Very last minute. Uh, let's just see. I don't get why you guys say L boyfriend. Like who the like guys? My girlfriend is not insecure. Okay. Hey Tori. Yeah. Where you at, Mister? Where you at, Tori? I'm in Vegas. I thought you're in LA. I'm coming. I'm on my way back right now. Okay, you're coming. Mr. Aiden. I'm. You're coming. I'm on my way. Are you coming? Yes. Are you coming right now? I am on my way. Yes, I am officially on my way. You're officially coming? LA. You're officially coming? I'm officially on my way, yes. You're coming? <laughs> Just come fast. Bro, super fast. <laughs> oh, okay. I love Tori. Bro, chat, you guys can't lie. It's going to be a W stream when he, when he comes over, bro. It's going to be so good. Um, L boyfriend. Like I like I like I actually meant that. You fucking sick fuck. Um Jesus Christ, bro. That shit's gonna be hilarious. Um Uh wait, what did Tina just say? 
Uh, Tina, not today, I don't think. Probably tomorrow's stream. Uh, chat, possible Tory Lane's stream is either tomorrow or the next day. Oh, yeah, chat. Do you guys remember when Ziaz fucking banged my head on the wall? Look at the fucking dent. Look at it, bro. Not this. This is from the chair. Look at that. That's my fucking head. Bro, like, that's actually fucked up, bro. Like, like it actually really hurt. I probably had a concussion. I don't even know. For all I know, I don't even know, bro. Like, that shit really hurts. Your bionic tooth chipped the wall. Yo, Royce, you're ugly as fuck, bro. Hey, Royce, what time do you guys want to get on the Mimic? Uh, what time are you guys trying to get on the Mimic? I'm cool with getting on it at any time, bro. Um, I don't really give a fuck. Aiden, you have the same shorts on, take a shower. Let me explain something to you guys. See, you guys know I have... I have... I could buy designer clothes. I could go out and buy clothes. I don't care, bro. Does it look like I give a fuck? The jewelry that I got is was given to me. I I try to not spend money on clothes because you guys are just like me. I know a lot of you guys really don't give a fuck just like me. I guess what? I I haven't showered in four fucking days. I don't care. My, my I don't care. I know I haven't showered in four days. I've been wearing the same underwear probably for like three days. I'm just letting you guys know how it is, bro. I don't give a fuck. All right. I'm grinding like I'm broke. I don't care. Look at my fucking room. If I was in a professional ass setup with a clean ass room, you guys would say, you're changing, you're fucking fake, you're Hollywood. All this crazy shit. All right. Even when I'm 27 years old, bro, I'm still going to be doing what I'm doing, bro. Do you think I give a fuck? Do you guys think I give a fuck? Are you guys all like me? If you're all like me, put yes, I'm like you, Aiden, in the chat. You don't take showers that often. You're literally in quarantine. Why do you have to take a shower every fucking day? You're literally fucking weird if you say no. I'm not bragging about being dirty, dumbass bitch. I'm just bragging about not being fancy and bougie. Does it look like I fucking chip my toenails? No, I bite them shits. Like, bro, like, the only bougie thing about my life is my car, to be honest with you. That's it. And honestly, bro, I'm giving that car away to some, one of my family members. And I'm probably going to be driving a fucking, I don't even know, bro. Like, I, you know what I mean? I'm just myself. I'm not ever going to change for everybody else. I'm not going to change for money, bro. I don't even, like, I love my car, bro, but I'm giving it literally to somebody in my family, bro, because they'd probably appreciate it more than I would appreciate it. Let me tell you guys something about money, bro. You gain more pleasure and you get more happy when you spend money on other people that you love and fuck with. And that's just a fact. If you go buy your boy shit, you go buy your mom shit, your dad shit, you're going to gain way more. Forget the voice crack. You're going to gain way more pleasure than doing that than buying shit up for yourself. I bought myself $5,000 worth of sneakers two days ago. When I got home, threw it on the fucking floor. I bought um, a fucking, uh, 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 my boy, uh, like $2,000 sneakers. Just for always being my boy, like day one shit. I felt so happy. You know what I mean? So I'm letting you guys know how it is, bro. But uh, let's start to re let's go react to these videos. Uh, family first. Uh, I need to take a shower for sure. <laughs> let me check on the barber one more time. Uh, let me FaceTime him, actually. What's the barber's name, chat? You guys should know. His name is Versetti. Versati. He's so hot. Mr. Lanes will be on tomorrow's stream. Nah, Pammy, Pammy, uh... Yo, great. Thanks for the five. Get the subs, motherfucker. Imagine if you showered every day. I don't need to, bro. Why would I need to? I already have a girlfriend, bro. She doesn't care. Pammy likes it when I'm, like, Pammy, like, likes that I'm dirty. I'm just kidding. No, she doesn't. But she likes that, like, I, like, let me tell you guys something right now. Let me ask, let me tell you guys something right now. Um, I can smell you from my monitor. Like, Pammy just doesn't care, like, that, like, I cut the beard. Why would I cut the beard, Mr. Mayweather? Why the fuck would I cut the beard? I'm not cutting the beard. I can't. That's not healthy, bro. Uh, you have dick cheese? It's It tastes good. Girls like that. I don't know what the fuck to tell you. I do have really good hygiene. We got a hype train started, chat. We're about to hit 60,000 Twitch subs. Holy fuck. Take thanks for the 10. Give the chat. We're literally 500 subs away right fucking now. And I will do a, a hot sub stream with Summerette. And if you guys get it to me within the next... Now, nah, you guys will get it at the stream for sure. I was going to say some crazy shit. Yo, Dad, thanks for the five gifted subs, bro. Uh, the first hot sub stream with Summer Rae is going to happen 
Uh, appreciate everyone gifting subs. Much love to everybody. Look how down bad you guys are. Nah, I'm just kidding. Are you guys going to, uh, be honest though, are you guys going to stroke to the stream? And not stroke because of summer. Are you guys going to stroke because of me? Put yes in the chat. I cannot fucking wait to do it. <laughs> On God I would. I know you would, baby. <clears throat> Alright, let's watch this fucking video, yeah? Celery baby. Send it to me, you dumbass bitch. All right, guys. So look, let me tell you guys a little backstory about this shit. Chat, no disrespect. I've never heard of this person before she was on my stream. But I will say Blueface is a fucking genius. Because Blueface... No way, Temper. No fucking way, Tommy. No way, Tommy. No way, bro. Tommy, no fucking way. How many did you just give? Tommy, no way, bro. Temper. Tommy. How many did he just gift, bro? A hundred? Everyone add Temper right now and say, I fucking love you, bro. Bro, you guys gotta understand, I literally grew up watching Temper, Rain, Jev, Banks, in that New York house, Adapt, Apex, right? And it's just crazy that these motherfuckers are my friends now. Fuck that, they're my brothers now. It's just all crazy. Temper, the only thing you guys fucked up on is you should have signed me to FaZe. I'm just kidding. I'm technically already in FaZe, bro. I rep it. I fucking suck Banks' dick every night. I'm technically in FaZe. Um, I have a fucking FaZe bear brick in the back. Anyways, so uh, that's just crazy. That's just crazy to me, bro. It's just, it's just crazy. It's beyond crazy. Uh, you have to re-VIP him. All right, I got you. I'm going to give him a mod. I love, I love, I love my FaZe boys, bro. Fate. I don't want to accidentally throw up a fucking gang sign. I really don't know how to fucking do the face sign, but fuck, bro. Um. <laughs> Yo. AK with the 50 gifted. Everyone put W's in the chat. Holy fuck. Take with the 10 gifted. Bro, holy fuck. How you do the face sign, bro? I don't even know. You guys know what I'm trying to do. Um. Anyways, uh, everyone put W's in the fucking chat uh, for everybody gifting subs. It's literally an F. Yeah, how do I do it, dumbass? Let me call Banks. Like that. Whatever, bro. Uh, I love FaZe, bro. We were, it's FaZe on top for good. Uh, fuck 100 Thieves. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, no, I fuck 100 Thieves too, but uh, FaZe on top, though, for real, for real. FaZe is the craziest shit of all time. Chat, which is them right now, bro. Uh, FaZe literally made fucking gaming what it is today, how big it is. Yo, D Dean with the 10 get there. Everyone put dubs in the chat. Um, but what's it called? We're going to go ahead and watch the uh, phase the fuck up. There we go. Phase up, guys. On God, I'm trying to throw a face sign. So nobody twist my words. Chat, we're literally 100 subs away. Or I think 200 subs. Yeah, 200 subs away from 60,000 subs. When we hit 60,000 Twitch subs, we are going to do a hot tub stream with Summer. All right. I will lock it in. I will confirm it. We will do a hot tub stream with Summer. Uh, it's going to be fucking crazy. So, yeah. Also, we are going to be doing a crazy ass thing this fucking stream as well. Where's Big DZ? I'm pretty sure he's here. Him and B-Lord just do it, taking care of some business right now. Um, why not Pammy? She's sick right now. When, she's felt, uh, when she feels better, I'm, I'm going to definitely do one. Uh, Citrus, everyone at Citrus and say thank you. He's trying to get me a collaboration with Ryan Garcia. Um... Crazy ass hype chain, you guys are crazy. Let's just uh let's just fucking watch this video. So chat, um I'm not trying to throw any I'm gonna just try to say this in the in the most like you guys know I am the most respectful way possible. I'm I hate to fucking disrespect people, but obviously I was clearly disrespected by this person. Um if you don't know, bro. Chat, is this facts or no facts? You guys did not hear about her until she came on my stream. Facts or no facts, that's all I'm asking. Just facts or no facts. I see her all over TikTok now. I see her shit fucking just crazy. Blueface is a genius. He texted me, Aiden, this shit's about to go more viral than before. 
I said, yeah, right. It really fucking did. He's a genius. Uh, he's actually a fucking genius. I fuck with Blueface. He actually texted me last night. Me and Blue are cool as fuck. Again, just uh, felt disrespected by this person. First time meeting you, you know, it would have been great if we had a, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta be nice, you know, to, to, to people who are trying to help you out and expand your career. Uh, I was never trying to be mean to at all. Um, but, you know, energy is a really important thing. And uh, uh, this is the last time I'm ever going to touch base on this. Uh, I don't want beef or problems with you. Supposedly, she said she wants to fight me when she sees me. Uh, it's an 11-minute video. We're going to see what she has to fucking say. Um, but again, Blueface, I fuck with you, bro. Uh, let's just see. I'm Supposedly, I got, I got dissed. So uh, let's fucking watch this shit, yeah? Okay, she she knows my shit. My name is not Admin, bro. Come on, bro. She said Admin can talk shit all he wants. I don't talk shit. I I would say that I did get disrespectful a little bit, but not as disrespectful as you got to me. Um, and again, that's because you came on to my you came to my house. You know, I I I helped you out. Um. And you know, I, I don't want anything in return. I just we play we played your music. It's it's not. I'm not gonna hate on your music. Of course, I make music myself, kind of, or, or I'm gonna start to. So, uh, but what I'm saying is like, I'm not gonna hate on your music, but like obviously that promoted the fuck out of you from coming onto my stream. So I just want you to understand that like when you come on to a a, a platform and a people who don't even know who you are, and then you kind of show that like you're not maybe respectful, people are gonna hate you. And I'm not directly sending hate towards you, but people are just not going to like that. If I'm streaming and you're on my stream and people are see how you're treating me because they all love me. They're here for me, right? They're not going to fuck with the way you treat me. You get what I'm saying? So that's my community probably fucking, you know, going crazy. Uh, but they love me, you know? Elmo Slayer, thanks for the 25 gifted. Everyone put dubs in the fucking chat. Um, thank you so much, Elmo. We're about to hit 60,000 Twitch subs. This is fucking crazy. We're literally like 110 away. So if you guys got Amazon Prime, Twitch Prime, click subscribe right now. You can sub it free. Appreciate everyone subbing the fuck up. We're about to literally hit 60,000 Twitch subs. That is insane, bro. He's boo. Tell all he want. I don't care. That's why he's boo. Hey, he be acting gay. Admin be acting gay. Okay, again, my name is not Admin. Um, if she calls me admin the entire video, bro, I swear to God, I'm going to have to pop a Tylenol. I'm going to have, <laughs> I'm going to have a fucking level three migraine, but hold on, bro, bro, chat, don't call me admin. Listen, I'm going to tell you guys something right now. I, I, you know, you guys know my personality. You guys know my humor. Um, there's nothing wrong with it. Um, I, I, do you guys, I have a question. Do you guys think that people, some people out there might get offended by my streams? Honestly, everyone be honest. I'm seeing 50-50. Um, I would hope not, but if you do get offended by me, just know I'm genuinely really sorry to anybody that gets offended by me. Um, but just know that I love and respect everybody. I treat everybody like the same. Nobody's better than anybody. Whatever. You guys know that. Okay, whatever. Surprise, he got a girlfriend. I didn't want to smell your chair, bro. Who was there? Who, who saw what happened, bro? I played fucking rock. I played fucking rock, paper, scissors to not smell your chair. That was the meme. We didn't, no, none of us wanted to smell your chair. Literally nobody wanted to play. Nobody wanted to fucking smell your chair. 
Not one person in that room wanted to smell it. Chat, who in this chat would smell her chair? I'm good. <laughs> I cap. <laughs> bro, you guys are funny as fuck. Hold up, bro. All right. Nah, Flood, you're down bad. I don't give a fuck, you're down bad. <laughs> Cuff him in snaggy wood. <laughs> All right, let me chill, let me chill. Boy. Don't do that. I didn't want to. On God, I did not want to. these people going crazy. So, yeah. Tell ad admin. Bro, oh my. How many times? Chat, let's count how many times you said admin. That's three. Chat, keep track the entire time, alright? Our arch nemesis is it's rock. What? I don't know why it came for me. Probably because they're blue. We don't like him. Alright, look. This is the crazy part here. Chat, if I were to fight... First of all, chat, is it legal to fight? No. <laughs> Sorry. This famous nigga that I got on, I lived over there. I'll tell you after this. Look, what's going so, um, my dog, come here, Rock. Let me show you, dog. Oh, y'all. Yeah. That's actually a cute dog. Look at my dog. He might die. What? We don't know what it is. It could Yo. Yo. I'm streaming. Right there. Okay, I actually, all right, actually, prayers up for the prayers up for the dog, though, bro. Nah, prayers out for the dog. For real, for real. That could be... Uh, I don't know what it could be. Y'all just may. Y'all just may. All these people made in here. I don't care. Yo, Eric, chill, bro. Well, y'all know. How about y'all go tune in on my on my uh MM music? I'm going back over at admin house. No. I'm gonna say sorry to him. A FaceTime would be better. Matter of fact, it's okay. I didn't know that she actually wanted to apologize. Hold on, let's see what she has to say. But how are you gonna say I'm sorry, admin? But he's gonna have to say sorry to me because he the one was talking about. What? To him, but he's gonna have to say sorry to me because he the one was talking about my teeth. So <laughs> Chat. Bro, this is fucking insane, bro. I'm sorry I'm pausing it so much, bro. I'm really sorry, bro. I just can't. All right. So, fuck all y'all. Y'all keep talking about my team. She just this SSB, bro. Hey. I'm better than all y'all. Chat. She heard what she just said. She said she looks better than everybody in SSB. What do you guys have to say about that? With the I look better than everybody that's commenting right now. 
fuck is he talking Damn, about? chat. Damn, chat. <laughs> Yo, chat. Ugly wear. Bitch never could been ugly. That's the thing. Snaggy no. and cuff them. What fuck? I'm gonna have a special guest on my uh on my live, just like admin. Since he wanna be a jerk. What? Since he wanna be a dickhead. Since he wanna be a dick eater. Since he wanna be gay. All the lit people gonna come on my live. Nice. That's really, really good for your for your brand to to First of all, if I was gay to say that, that's that's very that's very nice to discriminate. Nice. Good job. Nice. Hey. Yo chat. Chat. Well, hold on, chat, 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 chat. Fuck, bro. Uh, chat, I gotta show you guys something, bro. This dude right here. Robert just said she's fine, Loki. Robert won. Four K. <laughs> what are the mods? Did you just ban him? Nah, you guys are weird. Did he just get banned? <laughs> well, I don't know what's the problem. No one has to fuck with me. That's the thing. Wait, well, nobody has to what? No one has to fuck with me. That's the thing. Chad, what did you say? Nobody has to what? You see these chains? Yeah, Lord Dusty, but, you know, get the Lord Dust off, but, yeah, baby, give me. Oh, fuck with me. Y'all acting all like that. We're so close to 60,000 Twitch subs, holy shit. So what happens when, my dog, um, is, I don't know, Rock, keep shut up. You swell up like that? How old is he? Wait, wait, what? What? Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. How did something go up his butt, bro? Bro, wait, no, chat. Am I tripping? Like, why does chat? Why does weird shit always just fucking like that? We we react to just like like what? That's like what? Oh, oh, it's okay, bro. Yeah, that's really hard. Oh, really you don't even do all that. Chill out. You don't even bite. So something is going on inside. That's why he has swelling. Um, I don't know if you got bit by a spider or got bit by something. Have you noticed that? It got hit on the face? I don't know. What do you, you know? think? It's going to be anything. That's the thing. I mean, you can give him a shot of an anti inflammatory like a steroid. Can see. you, like, draw it out? No, no. Joiling it out means, like, we have to sedate him then. Okay. And then we can sedate him and try to see if there's anything, um, like, numb that area. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, I don't think there's anything in there. Can you see that? cool. Someone said her tooth one. Nah, bro, you guys are weird. <laughs> nah, you guys are weird, bro. Yeah, I just need to see what's wrong. Really... It's not like a... I don't know what's wrong with my dog. My dog. Do you think there's something in there? Yo, came with the five gift. Appreciate you, brother. Like a couple of days, probably. Two days now? A couple of days. Like, it was little as hell. Okay. Didn't really notice it, but I'm like, hmm, maybe he hit right, his head. Let, let, if you hold him, let's try it without it, see if you tolerate it. Okay. Let me bring the syringe, okay? Okay. Yeah, we about to sedate my little 
So if my dog is about to die, that nigga gonna buy me a new dog. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga that keep talking about my tooth gonna buy me a new dog, and I'm gonna force it to him. I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. What? <laughs> so fucking funny, bro. Now I need to call my mom. I need to roll up. That shit big as shit, yo. Marsh. You gonna, gonna say, I can give him a shot, maybe. No, nigga. Check that shit out. That's the only way they gonna be able to know that they got some food from me. Hey, check him out. My dog is finna die. And when you said she got the confidence. Y'all just mad. Y'all mad that I'm... What? Poor dog, for real, though. Y'all keep calling me a bitch? Fuck you. Okay. What are you doing? Who does that in the middle of a fucking... What? Who literally does that while their dog is, like... Bro. Who does that, bro? Too fucking fast. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what I'm ready to do is. Is this the rest of the video, bro? Come on. Steal your boyfriend. They all like that. He lied. Man. Uh, when you walk in that nigga house, it smell like eggs. The fuck is you talking about? Who, oh, mine? Might be his fucking. They all like that. I don't even know how all these people are. So, let's get into it. So, my name is Krishan. I run track. I used to. It's almost done, chat. Facts. Who goes live with their dog in the hospital? <laughs> like, actually, though. What? Why trying to come on here looking pretty? Then what? What y'all gonna say? Melvin. They all like Sedan. Sedan. How the fuck is Sedan? All right, bro. I hope I hope the dog's all right, bro. I really do. I hope the dog's all right. Um, yeah, man. I'm done entertaining this, bro. All right. We're done talking about this shit. We're done entertaining this shit. Nothing to really entertain or talk about. All right. We uh, there is one video. Someone said. So oh, so she got knocked out. She got knocked out, so that's why she had to. She has no tooth. Oh, 
Oh shit. Got you a smoothie. You okay? All right. Hold it for me. I got you. Rock head out. Can you Keep your legs up so she can push you. It's okay. It's not about the money. You're going to fix your teeth. Don't worry. Okay? Are you high? Yeah. You off the meds? Alright, well. Don't worry. Don't worry about the money, okay? You straight? We on our way back? You a tough cookie, cuz. You a tough cookie. Out of it. How much they said it was gonna cost? Too much. You said too much? Well, who cares? Because we're gonna fix everything. Alright. That's really nice of him actually. He covered it, he covered uh covered her bill. That's really nice of him. I have a better smell than if we even got here. Wait, but he wait, but chat, how long ago was this? October 14, 2020? <laughs> Why is it not fixed? <laughs> bro, oh my god, bro. Oh, it's a smoothie, it's a smoothie, it's a smoothie. It's not blood, it's a smoothie. Y'all hear that? Hello? Hello? No fighting? No arguing? Echo! Oh, yes, girl. I'm tired. I'm going to go to sleep. No, I'm tired. I'm going to talk to you guys. I talk to you guys. on it. What the oh my god, guys. This is a very rare sight right now, guys. Yo, fair everybody, they're gonna fight gifted, bro. She even sleep like a nigga. Don't wake her up. Don't wake her up. Crap, let, let her. Oh, yeah, don't be Wait, chat, what did he just call him? Look at that, man. Oh, Craig? Okay. Very sorry. You ever seen an alligator sleep, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> These women are cracked on Fox. Somebody only me fan subscription. Talk the price until I hit. Once I hit, to the search. I got it. Come on, sunshine. Quick. Now this regular. Back. Nah, I got it. Nah, I'm playing. I think he's gonna be able to handle this. Y'all got into a fight. Who's one? I don't know. I really like him. All right. Stop skipping. There's really nothing else to fucking like. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, we got Trap Gee to watch. Um, Find the fight. I don't know if I can pull that up, bro. I don't know if I can pull that up. Lakers at Suns, full game highlights. After this, we watch Trap Geek. After that, could probably play the scary game, bro. No cap. I want to watch this shit. First of all, chat, how good are the Lakers doing uh, in, 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 in the playoffs? We're going to find out right now. And you hear a very familiar refrain from the... Uh, also, chat, what team do you guys got winning the finals? Fans. Beat LA. See, AD needs to be doing the tip off, bro. I love Drummond, bro, but you guys all know Anthony Davis gets up higher than every single fucking player on the fucking court, except for obviously LeBron. So AD needs to be doing the tip. Shooter off the Davis screen. The 15 footer is good. Dennis Shooter is actually really the Lakers fucking on good. the board first. 
always five out. As Chris Paul gets in, Chat. another wide open three. I swear to God, I didn't even know that Chris Paul was on the Suns. I swear on my life. Since when has Chris Paul been on the Suns? I thought he was on the fucking Rockets. Defers to Booker for the long range jumper. Here's James at the off. He got shaded at All Star. Okay. Oh, his shoulder. Okay, that's why. Defensive end Crowder guarding him as he did last year a lot in the finals as a member of the Beautiful. Heat. He's, the, he's one of the best jump shots in the game, bro. Form, form wise, form looking wise. He really does. The lob and Aiton got it to go. DeAndre Aiton's a great player. Suns leading 10 Pull 9. It. LeBron Beautiful. for three. 10. And LeBron James. LeBron, LeBron's the LeBron's jump shot is just got very, five. very like. Aiton lost the handle. It's Here's Schroeder coming back for the Lakers. Great. The Suns, though, Lob. back nicely in transition. LeBron can't do that. Another dude. one. That's two for two. He, who else do you know that's 38 years old just fucking Hit the playing this good, bro? It's crazy. One. Back comes Chris Paul. And Paul for three. Got hey, it. that's another veteran, though. You can't disrespect them, bro. That's another veteran. And back comes Crowder. They got a three on one. Eight and running the floor. Ooh, that was a good try, though. That was a good try, Schroeder. Paul weaving through That's... traffic. Oh, okay. Yo, DeAndre Aiden, yo, Mo Money with the big Everybody 50 gifted. Everyone with dubs in a fucking chat. Mo Money, thank you so much for the big 50 gifted. Bro, um, go back. Bro, I'm not going to lie. CB3 got saved right there, but... Pick. Let's call it a pass. DeAndre Aiden, Aiden is good points. as fuck, bro. Everybody talked about LeBron being absent. How much do you think the Lakers miss Schroeder? AD, yeah, hold him now, hold him now, hold him now, AD. Valuable. Mr. Malala's camp. You gotta, you gotta get that one, though. Over Anthony Davis. In defensive Sorry, guys. Hey, game one, LeBron always doesn't... The Utah Jazz. Yeah. LeBron started off hot. Beautiful pass. Nice assist to Harrell for the slam. Booker being chased by Kuzma. Tough shot. Got it. That's a very wow. hard shot. That's a very hard shot. Of shot how many points did AD have this game? Transition. Horton Tucker takes it to the rack. And a nice follow by LeBron. He's James, literally. Who's now bro, got 10 points. He's and basically 40 years old doing what he's doing. Oh, boy. Right oh, no, Chris. You all right? Of his neck and trapezius muscle area right there. And a moment ago, he was helped off the court. Players from both teams gathering around. Payne with a sidestep three. And one and done. Hit Bron, hit Bron. Give it to Bron. Yep. James, Good great pass. pass to Harrell. And one, that's a foul. And one. And Chris Paul left. It was 38-29. Nice. to 29. Lakers on a 6-0 run. Devin Booker is great. Since he left, Booker stops the hemorrhaging. Lakers battling, but the Suns control. Booker on the move. Slams it home. Damn, bro. How many points did Devin Booker have tonight? Nutrition and dietary change went to a plant-based diet. He feels it's helped wow. his longevity. Hey, DeAndre Aiden is inside. really fucking good. Chris Paul. Good pass. You talk about his longevity. He played 70 out of the 72 games this year. Booker inside. I can't lie. This Sun team is nice. Wait, Chad, what seed are the Suns? He picked up his third foul. Let's see if Sarge can make the same play. He just traveled. I swear to God, Aiden he just traveled. To finish. Now, look, I know the NBA lets a lot of shit slide, but wa literally watch his feet. Let's see if Sar Sorry. Sarge can Patient move. My bad, guys. Look, right here, right here. Foul. Watch Booker. Let's see if Sarge can make the same play. Dude took like three steps before he dribbled. Like, that's actually fucking crazy. Don't let that shit slide. It's the playoffs. They're down. They're up 10 points. Don't let that shit slide. That's why when they're back in LA chat, I promise you right fucking now, they're about to go stupid, bro. The Lakers are not going to lose one home game. And they're going to play. They're going to beat the Suns the next game. I promise you. He's that Aiton was to finish. Boy, Booker in rhythm right That's now. That's a tough shot. In one of the regular season games against the Suns, but in that game, he had 42. Caldwell Pope goes in a hurry. Davis, thank you very nice. much. And again, I like him at the five. To get his shot right, the coaching staff says, look, he's going to go out here and give it everything he has. They don't intend to change the game plan because he's a little bit... He's a hot, he's a hot player, player, bro. LeBron, they you come gotta, up I don't with know if going to stop Booker. For real. Quickly to Schroeder. Drives and gets the layup. Yeah, over it's hard. Crowder. And what you can't do is turn the basketball over. 
Eight and off the inbound pass. Here's Booker. Chased by two over to Bridges for three. About you've surrounded your best players with what they need. He's the shooting goal. and tough. He's a great Speaking ass. Speaking of shooting, LeBron knocks down the three ball. He's up to 13. And yes, James Jones. When you look at last November, as Chris Paul loses the handle again, he just doesn't look quite right. Aiden says, "Look what I found." Yo, AD, you've been playing too much GTA roleplay, bro. Fuck the gaming shit, bro. You gotta, you gotta get back in the gym, bro. For real. I'm, I, look, look, like I'm noticing it, bro. Like he's not hustling that much. I don't know if he, is he hurt. Is he hurt, bro? Is he hurt? I'm just fucking with you guys. You know, uh, again, I'm at the point where if I say some shit like that, it's gonna get back to him. Anthony, you're playing amazing. I believe in you fully. I, I know that you guys are gonna win a chip this year. We're all rooting for you. Uh, help LeBron get his fifth ring. We already know that you guys are gonna go crazy and fucking get this shit. We love you. LA loves you. And I'm gonna be going to the next, the first Laker game. So I'm excited. Acquire Jake also, as if you are in New York, well. he's gotta come on the New York shit. Drummond keeping it alive. A one man show on the glass. Oh, yeah. Facts. Little bully ball on Schroeder, his former teammate, and gets That's the tough, bro. That's role. tough. That's tough. And they win all year long. He's played a valuable part. Takes the opposing team's primary perimeter. Up, Who is that, bro? DeAndre Ayton is amazing, bro. He's amazing. Ayton with a slam and a timeout. It's like a basketball team in order for them to have success. He kicks it out to the Great. top to Schroeder. Great ball in the round. KCP hit that. Caldwell Pope nice. hits the three. That's the type of shooting that Houston, you love that about. Oh, uh, AD, you Indian can't jump on that, bro. Several times. It's Crowder Dennis Crowder. You can't fucking jump on that shit. Crowder stops for the three. See, he can't shoot. Bridges. Fuck, bro. One isn't that late in the game, but... Every possession counts, especially for the Lakers right now, down by 15 in the front court. Don't push it, don't Schroeder, push it. A burst of speed in a bucket. All right. Schroeder See, they're playing good ball, bro. Off to James Green, pocket pass to LeBron. Up high in traffic, a nice catch and bucket by Drummond. Wow. Anthony Davis, just 3 of 11 in this ball. Chat, I love AD. I love AD, but tell me guys right now, how many points did Anthony Davis have tonight? I got to know. I got to know his stat line. I got to know his stat sheet. How many points did he have? 13. Okay. Oh, that's crazy. See, he has to He has to be putting up more. I think he knows that. And how many points did Braun have? Braun had 21. 18. See, Braun could do that, though. Braun could do that. Braun's cool doing that. AD, you're the, you're, the, you're the best person on the team right now. Anthony Davis is the best scoring person on the team. He's the best scorer on the team. And that's just a fact. Ball game. Schroeder aggressive to the bucket, gets it to fall, and Monty Williams calls a timeout with an audio problem. Yeah. <laughs> Crowder catching two three. Bro, again, you leave Dennis Crowder wide open. He's not fucking hitting that shit. Anthony, step back and leave him open and get the fucking rebound. Back out to Johnson Payne with another opportunity. Finally, got one. Bro, hotel room. They have shooters everywhere. Why the fuck do you leave? Bro, he obviously can't shoot. I've literally seen him. It's like four threes, bro. China decided he didn't want it's to play in the annoying, Chinese bro. Basketball League and got that phone call from Monty Williams. That's where we need the wire to confirm. You're a fake Laker fan. Suspicion. He plays for the Suns. He's an idiot, bro. Been, young fella, take a seat. <laughs> Matthew, Big man is coming in. You tell your team. Nothing. They, they, they've been here in, in other games. We it's got not Dennis Crowder. What's his name then, bro? Learn from this, but we got to do what we've done all year long. Be consistent, stable, and strong, and we'll be okay. Caruso in the paint for Harrell. LeBron James begins the fourth quarter for the Lakers. Harrell with a sweeping hook that falls. What the fuck? Uh, he's played well. <laughs> LeBron cross court. Hit that Caruso. Caruso at the offensive end. Gets the lefty layup to fall. Jay Crowder. It's a 12-point game. Okay, okay. Three-point line. Exactly. He shot the free throw. Oh, yeah. Ron corrals the loose ball. And one. Takes it in. Oh, and foul. One. Thank you. Got the foul. And will go to the line. James missing again at the foul line. A whistle. James Fuck. goes down hard to the court. Chaz, you all right? Caruso and Payne get into it. Montrez Harrell runs into campaign. And coaches leave the bench area as things become a little bit contentious here. After review, the 
Bro, what is he ear raping me in the background? On the Lakers, one's on Alex Caruso, one is on Harold. There's also two technical fouls on Phoenix. Both are on Cameron Payne. He's been ejected. Wow. They double team him over to Chris Paul. Two of you guys are really spamming the flop. You would not do that shit if LeBron was on my stream. You guys are being a bunch of pussies, bro. You guys are all going to be really sad when LeBron retires, too. So go fuck yourselves. And it, it, it's just a fact. You're literally all going to be miserable when he retires. So go fuck yourselves, bro. Genuinely, respectfully, go fuck yourselves. Guarded by Kuzma. Tough shot by Paul. To travel, to travel, bro. Guarded Every fucking player travels. By Kuzma. Look at this. One, two, three. Like, look Tough at that, bro. Like, Every fucking player travels. It's annoying as fuck. Here's Booker. Guarded by Caruso. It's not even a cross. Caruso just Booker can't play defense. Rolls around and falls. He back up to 13. Anthony Davis still yet to make an imprint on this game. And as I say so. Is that a foul? And he one, let's down go. the mid-range jumper. Kicks it out to Caldwell Pope. Schroeder lines up the three. Got it. And Dennis Schroeder is a game. really good player. Booker on Caruso. Got inside over that, Davis. Too late. Anthony Davis, you're not playing the normal. Like I can't, I can't explain it, chat. Chat, what would you guys blame tonight's loss on? First of all, it's a team sport. Everybody, it's everybody. But would you guys say that like AD if he contributed more, they would have won? Honestly, bro, could you guys could you guys agree with me? Okay, you guys are all saying AD. Thank you, bro. Thank you. I know I'm not a casual. I know what I'm talking about, bro. Crosses over Caldwell Pope. Here's Bridges. From 15, halfway down and out, tipped in. Like, AD, get a fucking rebound. Look, you got a box Look, out. Bridge. Why is he coming out of the box out? Because Crowder's open. Guess what? Crowder missed like five threes. Chat, I swear to God. Chat, chat, every single time we watched him shoot a three, did he not miss it every single fucking time? Caruso, who the fuck are you guarding? He has no defense. Like, it's actually really bad. Caruso has no fucking defense. Caruso, just literally play gap defense between fucking Crowder and fucking uh, the ball. It's not that hard. He can't shoot. He cannot shoot. AD had to give up this box out. I get it. AD's a great player. He saves players' asses. But come on, bro. Don't give up the box out, especially in this tight game, bro. Yes. There's three seconds on the clock. He's going to shoot the fucking ball. From 15, halfway down and out. Lazy. In by Aiden. Booker. They double team him. Crusoe, what are you? Nice flash to the foul line by Bridges, and he knocks it home. An uphill climb for them for most of the afternoon. Schroeder over to Davis. Go. Caruso drifts to that. the corner nice. and knocks home the three. Three minutes. If they get this lead down, that's crazy. Booker, they hit the man at the free throw line. Crowder! Crowder, you're really good at middies, bro, but when it comes to the three ball, you're not hitting that shit, bro. And, it's, and, and, and everybody in the chat fucking knows it. Butter. With an injured Chris Paul, Devin Booker was able All right. to lift up. That's not good. CP3 was injured, and this still happened, bro. Okay, so I'm going to tell you guys right now the reason. I want to watch the Knicks. All right. Um... Guarding Julius Randle, who has had his own. After this, uh, we can watch the fucking uh, the video. Uh, so I just said he's the best perimeter defender on the team. Uh, actually, LeBron is the best perimeter defender uh, on the Lakers, buddy. Uh, and that's a fact. Um, so, uh, yeah. MVP caliber season for the Knicks. There are officials. Tony Brothers, our crew chief. Manage. But overall, so far, they're 2 of 13. Up top, it's Young, beautiful dime. That's crazy. Just All a right. miraculous turnaround under Nate McMillan. They're Herder, shooters, bro. They're, shoot hey, three. This is the Hawks. Good. They shoot the ball. They shoot the ball. That's the what they do, bro. All the injuries that the Hawks had this season. One nice. of the main saves was Herder. Look at Randall. Up and under. A terrific compliment to Trey Young for this Hawks team. Bogdanovich, their biggest free agent signing. I love their throws, bro. Going right it's through great. that Atlanta defense. And when you're struggling to make shots get to the rim, that's what the Knicks are starting to do here, but the Hawks are starting to heat up from beyond. Just to see it. How it's about tough, you bro. It's it? tough, bro. It's tough. We're so used to having sound pumped in 
And to be able to now and hear one. it. And you, they didn't call a foul, bro. You could just see the, 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 the refs are just so fucking biased. You see the difference, the adjustment that the Knicks are making. The rebound corralled by Rose. Hell, we're in the chat. Thank you, bro. The wall. Here comes D. Rose to the cup, puts it down as he goes glass. I'm going a little bit to contain the penetration of this Knicks team. Here's Gallinari. Puts it on the deck, taking Gibson a couple of fakes. As uh, Nate McMillan talking about getting his guys, Greg, prepped for this yeah. one. But uh, again, nothing quite like experiencing this. The, the shock to the senses. Derrick Rose is the most important player on the Knicks, bro. I'm when you sorry. start talking postseason and wanting to play deep into the playoffs to have that depth. What a pass, Burks. Boy, putting his in. Is that, is that Carlos Boozer right there? Or no, no, no. That's, that's, that's Tage Gibson. To the playoffs to have that depth. What a pass, Burks! Boy, putting his imprint on this game. The wraparound sides deep into their second. Chad, year. is that Gibson? Yes or no? I know it's not Boozer. I made an accident mistake. It's Gibson. See, they used to play together. But you guys didn't even know that. They used to play on the Bulls together. It's Tage Gibson. Units and good execution. I love Derrick Rose. Rose just keeps on. He coming. still has it. He still got it. Here's Tony Snell. He'll get Atlanta reset. Where did the Hawks turn for some points? Herter puts it on the deck, and he's fouled. Hey, Tom yo, Thibodeau. wait. <laughs> wait, what did you say? Turn for some points. Herter puts it on the deck, and... Am I tripping, bro? Did he, did he just say that shit? <laughs> and he's fouled. Tom Thibodeau. Here is quickly. Got off to that hot start. Damn. Denied by Capella. Loose ball to Burks, and how about... Hey, Clint Stewart? Capella's a demon. By Nate McMillan, and we know what Tom Thibodeau has done. This complete right of revitalization of the Knicks in New York. Quickly has to fire with four to shoot. Wow. And he puts it down. Great They're shot. within four. Great fucking shot. And this is where if you're Trey Young, it's time for you to kind of get going. Yeah, what has Trey Young done this the game? pick and roll. He's, been, he's able to get wherever he wants, which I think they're going to need. Damn! Toppin! Coming with some right-handed Who's that? Thunder. Good defense by the Hawks. Bogdanovich off the steal, pull up three. Wasn't a three, buddy. Look, look at his feet. A good defense. By the, the NBA lets so much shit slide, it's not even funny. Oh, Aiden, that is a three. Like, shut up, bro. Chat, two or three. Everyone spam two in the chat, bro. You can clearly see his fucking foot, bro. Bogdanovich off the steal, pull up three. Got it. Then Tom Thibodeau. Burks to drive, kicks out. Quickly puts it on the floor. Nice floater. The paint and hits. And he's taking it right to Trey Young. Beautiful. Out to Bogdanovich. Seven to shoot. Here's Collins. Wants to take Burks. Contact okay. and puts it down. Making it look easy. The defense realized the help was not coming. And show great patience there on the Bang attack. that. Oh, Beautiful. Nice high arc. Here's I like Collins. this top guy. Corner three too much. And the weak side rebound is controlled by the Knicks. Here's quickly. Splash. New York basketball My is goodness. back, motherfuckers. <laughs> it's been Look at Spike Lee. You know, th it's what playoff basketball is all about. Oh, yeah. You've got to be able to make the adjustments. I love fucking Derrick Rose. I love fucking Derrick Rose. Finish by D. Rose. D. Rose. D Rose. D Rose at times so far here in game one. There's Jamal Crawford. Someone who knows what this place feels like. For Trey Young had like 10 points tonight, bro. He, I've seen him do nothing. For Nick, Trey Young. Despite Randall's struggles, the Knicks. Ah, so he just airballed that. Two. Young barely nicks the front end of the rim. Here comes Barrett. Look to the, the Euro! Euro! RJ! And then the rebound underneath by Collins. Here comes Young. That's embarrassing. All the way to the cup. That's actually Trey really embarrassing. Young putting him on his back. In and loaded in and <laughs> taking away angles. Hit that. I think that's Come on, Maryland. In terms of their game plan. Beautiful. Trey Young first postseason appearance. You see his numbers. That is so Bullock. great. Trey Young has scored the last six for Atlanta. Bro, what is that? He's literally wide the fuck open, bro. I can literally make wide open lefts the entire fucking game. It's not even hard. He had two wide open layups, bro. Dude, probably had... And here he comes, turning the corner. Going glass! Here is Bogdanovich. On the deck, underneath, kicks hey, out to yo. Collins. Here he comes to the red. Get that shot out of your pussy ass, bitch! Noel. How do you lose that, bro? The Knicks early January after they let him go in the offseason. That uh, salary... Blah, 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 blah. 
Beautiful. Here is Barrett. Corner. Derrick Rose, you see shit I can't even see, bro. For the threes after he missed those first two. Got his rhythm by getting to the rim and then had the oh, first. Hey! Oh, shit! Holy shit! Yo, look at this. Those first two. He literally got up. Who got his rhythm by getting to the rim and then oh, had the first. Hey. To finish up over the top on Bogey. RJ Barrett. Look at him, Spike Justin Lee. Fisser. Is that Elon Musk? RJ Barrett. Je no, hey, <laughs> chat. Hey, chat, does he look like Elon Musk? <laughs> Low key, right? Just eviscerated the wreck. Which should give him an opportunity at the free throw line. Randall faces up on Collins. One dribble. And That's just beautiful. And the Mix takes the lead. That's I like that. Spot. Get that. Offensive rebound. It's Randall. RJ, I love you. Everywhere, RJ, I love and RJ. Keeps it up and in. Nix will reset. We come up on the final Who is 60 that? seconds. Burks <laughs> dropping it. Tage Gibson, you've always been good ever since the Chicago Bulls days. It's so awesome knowing that him and D Rose used to play together. It's fucking dope, bro. I like this new Nick squad. It's awesome, bro. Dime Gibson, Talk your shit. Talk your shit. Talk, your shit. Talk it. See if Atlanta goes two for one here quickly. It is Williams from the elbow, and he hits. His pass broken up. Stolen by Snell. Bro. Plenty of time. Williams steps in. This traveling has got to stop, bro. It's his pass broken up. Stolen by Snell. One, two, three. Like, look at this, bro. I get it. It's You don't want to stop basketball, but it's just... Look how close the game is. You can't give them points like that. NBA refs got to do something about this shit. I'm not even joking. You guys are saying eight in. Like, look at this. Cap, cap, like whatever, bro. You guys know that shit is wrong, bro. It's, it's not, it's not right. Imagine if you're playing for a, a trophy. This is your job, and you know you're you're getting robbed of shit like this. It's just stupid as fuck. It's called a gather, Aiden. I, I'm sorry, a gather is two steps, not three or four, bro. Plenty of time. William steps in. I'm with sorry. Three. It's Barry's bullshit. It. And Atlanta punches. Knicks versus the refs. Hey, hey, VIP, spam it up. Yeah, see Wolfie. Yes, Knicks versus the refs. See Wolfie. Thank you. Knicks. Versus the refs at this point, bro. He's back. A major shot in the arm in the first half. Now to Rose. Into the paint. Contact. How, do you, how does he do that? And Rose how? has been deadly. He's deadly. With the confidence of a first option guy. And he is delivering Who the for the fuck Knicks. is that? Danilo Gallinari. That's a three. Of the franchise in 2008. Massive triple for the Hawks. Three to shoot. Here comes quickly. Tough loader. Atlanta I like this next team down three here in game one Williams the paint defense is so bad Nerlens Noel you got to get there, bro That's your job. You're the paint protector, bro. You're the rim protector. That's your job, bro You got to box out and get the paint stop fucking leaving the paint, bro. That's your job all the way to the wreck Of the rim by the Knicks creating that opportunity for Noel and they're starting bro. to have some success. Nerlens Noel, if it happened back-to-back -back possessions. Nerlens Noel, you need to get up, bro. I get it. He's floating the ball up. You don't want to lose your plate. Just do it, bro. You can't let him do that. Go for the block and get the ball. Here in the second half. It's just ridiculous, Sweet Lou. Bro. My goodness. As we come up on the seven-minute mark. Wide open. Lift and regulation. Beautiful. Burks from the baseline. Hits again. What a ball game Shot we have. Resets to 14. It's into single digits. Ooh. Burks resetting. No Barnet way. Herder, fading Call away. me Herder shit. Puts it down. <laughs> Incredible shot. Really good in terms of executing their offense. Two point game. Hey. Randall. Now to Burks. Pull up. Who's this Burks guy? It. Bro, who's this Burks guy, bro? Somebody tell me his full name right now, bro. I'm actually DMing him. He's getting on my stream, bro. Him and RJ. I want the. Bro. I'm DMing them right now, bro. Who is this guy? Alec Burks? Bro. He doesn't have an Instagram. That's ass. Uh, RJ Barrett does for sure. I'm a DM. I'm going to say, yo, bro. You're a demon. The biggest pieces of this Nick team under Tom Thibodeau. Trey Young, you haven't really done that much this game, bro. And the garden was chanting, fuck Trey Young. I'm going to pull it up right after this game. 
And then they give him the responsibility of guarding the other team's best player. That's Capella on a tough catch in traffic. And the only important element of that is does it affect how he plays the rest pass, of the game? How about Good pass. that pass? You're not really doing anything, though. That's a three-point jack. That shouldn't dissuade you from making plays with the basketball. Here comes Young behind the back. Wow. This is Hunter. Hey, That's a Trey Young is pretty nice, bro, at passing. Because Trey Young is also making a statement <laughs> with how he is playing here down oh, the Oh, that's stretch. easy. Get him, RJ. Get him, RJ. 10-1 run for Atlanta. Barrett with the answer for the Look Knicks. at RJ. What a defensive recovery by Derrick Rose. Get it, Julius. Randall. Get it, Julius. Gets a Gibson screen. Get it, Julius. Puts it down. What a game. And the Knicks back in front. On cue, able to answer. Young. Chad, why? That first of all, he didn't even touch him. Look at both of his hands in the Knicks air. Knicks back in front. On cue, able. Watch Tage right here. Watch him. T Look at his hands. They didn't even touch him. Look, they're straight up. You can literally see his wrist right here. This is Tage. Answer. Young turns the corner. So hits dumb, the floor, bro. And he's got a chance at a three-point play. And he's given Atlanta a two-point lead. Rose into the paint, Gibson. Outside, Burks for three. Burks. Why not? Alex Burks, you are a fucking demon, bro. points in the quarter. Get it, Rose. And 25 Whoa. for the night. Rose, a little shimmy a shake. Kicks okay. out Burks. Alex! Under control. Oh, shot. shit! Hits again. Come on, Spike Lee. Coming on board, but it's also the personnel. Travel, moves travel, the hello. Decisions, even within the hello. season with Gibson and Rose. Bug moves they make. Dude, you can't let shit like that slide, bro. Just watch this shit. And Worldwide West coming on board, but it's also the personnel moves they made, the decisions. Actually, that wasn't a child. That's my bad. Even within the season with Gibson and Rose. Bogdanovich buries a three. It's Fuck, taken man. by Young. 30 seconds left. Young puts it on the deck. Here he comes. Contact. And boy, that nearly went. Hey, RJ, I'm not even mad at you, bro. That's good defense, RJ. The refs are just pussies. Hey, RJ, if you see this clip, bro, just understand that I fuck with you. New York loves you. That's great defense. You guys got fucking robbed. One of these guys pulled up for a fucking three, and it was it was actually a two. His foot was on the line. This motherfucker shouldn't have gotten fouled when Tage put his fucking hands up. RJ Barrett, you're playing amazing, bro. You're you're awesome. New York loves you. W, W, uh, uh just facts in the chat. Yeah, facts. Thank you. The Knicks during a regular season, and it's going to have a chance to hit that mark here potentially tonight. Giving his team some confidence, knowing that they've got one of those guys that could make plays. Where do the Knicks go here? It's Randall from three. Come Way on, Tage. too much. Gibson, offensive rebound. Alec. Here comes Burks. Shovel Rose. pass underneath, outside to Rose. Into the... Ah! shot, got it. We're tied. Let's see how they play this. Here is Young. Finds his spot. Young on the floater. Puts... Maryland's fucking Noel! Get in the fucking gym, bitch! This motherfucker just sold the entire game, bro. All they have to do is literally get the fuck up and play some fucking D! Oh my god, bro. This is actually really bad, bro. Literally, he's wide the fuck open. All he does is shoot layups. He's ass, bro! Here is Young. He didn't take one three this whole game, bro. Young. That floater shit is so bailed the fuck out, bro. Finds his spot. Young on the floater. So puts dumb, it in. bro. Trey Young with a miraculous. Bro, you had like 15 points, bro. And respectfully, you had great passes, but you weren't shooting any threes. You were boxed. You literally got lucky, bro. Shot. Was in all standing. Knicks looking for a miracle. Inbound to Randall. Fadeaway shot. Julius and is all it's good. over. All right, so now we got this extra clip right here, bro. I'm not hating, bro. Trey Young's an awesome player. He's oh, dope, bro. Well, they're psyched to be back in the postseason. Last three years. Nah, honestly, guys, you guys know it's all jokes in all games. No disrespect to Trey Young. Um, yeah. But yeah, you guys want to watch more games? Were any, were any one of those games close besides that one or not? Yes, sir. Birds in the trap. No 
more, no more, no, 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 no. I'm not gambling, bro. I'm not gambling, buddy. Chatty Dick. The Brooklyn versus Boston. If it's not close, there's no point of watching it. Chad, do you guys like my reactions to NBA games, though? Y'all fuck with them? Uh, every single playoff game, we're going to react if it's a close fucking game. So, um, yeah. Uh, no, no, no. No. Seeing a lot of yeses and nos. 50-50. Uh, uh, it's pretty dope. Uh, let's watch this one right here. We got a video about the uh, Young and Ace and Fulio. Uh, hopefully, I made this documentary. Shout out to uh, Trav Geek. You guys know I'm, I'm associated with uh, Young and Ace so, uh, and Fulio situation. So, hopefully, let's see if I'm in here. This is be my room right here. One boy shot my house up. I was right there on the bed. Me and my little brother, Quan Quan. They done shot my house up from right up. This is my mama's shit right up. They shot my mama's house up. They shot this part right up. My mama was in the room. They shot that bitch up. My whole, my house always got shot. They always spent on my shit. But then we doubling back though, for real. Come here though. The ATK gang. Investigators say this organization is connected to a string of murders in Jacksonville. There's many names for ATK. Ace. Top killers is one. Nine people you know, potentially responsible for the 15 murders that we know of and, and who knows what else. The day we're shooting scenes. Hold on, Snaggy hit me up, hold on. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Yo, yeah. I'm streaming what's good. You stream like for real. I muted it. It's unmuted. Uh, we'll talk about that later. Um, All right. But uh, what's it called, bro? You look very handsome today. I do. How you gonna let like, How you gonna let like Zs talk to me like that, bro? The, what can I say? If I were to defend you right there, he would hurt me. Now, Schnaggy, don't tell anyone this. I know my stream is unmuted, but chat. When when Schnaggy and all the SV boys were in Miami, we're gonna fucking beat Zs up. I don't go fuck Schnaggy. Hey Schnaggy. Hey Schnaggy. We're gonna beat his ass, Schnaggy. No cap. Help too. You better get some punches in, nigga. Oh, I am. Oh, Schnaggy, I'm gonna get some. I'm gonna bite. That nigga bullies him. He hits me. Schnaggy, I'm gonna bite. I'm gonna bite his fucking balls, bro. Like genuinely, like bite them. I'm gonna grab his ball sack and twist it. You are. Yeah. Okay, we should record. I'm gonna tell you. It's muted. It's muted. It's muted. Bro, I haven't been able. I haven't. I haven't been able to walk for two days, bro. My asshole hurts. Really? Yeah, you fucked me too hard. I know. I'm sorry, babe. This 16-year-old pussy is hurting. Why is it not I love you. Bro? I love you. Bro. Oh my God, bro. For, um, when I see you, who I smoke? Uh-huh. Who I Smoke came out of nowhere, went crazy, kind of made it more mainstream to where people who don't even know y'all, they were tapped into it. Did you 
make them do that? I don't know. How I took it too far when they made a song for speaker. Once the dead get involved, it's already too far. Hi, what is up everybody? For the past few months, the most talked about song on social media is the Huai Smoke video from Young and Ace. It exposed the mainstream to the deadliest rap feud that's been going on for years and it's happening in Jacksonville, Florida. Rappers from there are on a completely different wave, hiding the clues to revenge killings inside their music videos, taking the beats from classic pop songs. Hey, I gotta say one thing, chat. You guys can't lie, Trap Geek always comes crazy with these videos, bro. They always go crazy. Um, Priel, friends. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cuff them. Now you know when to tell somebody they're live, you stupid fuck. Songs and trying to rap the most demonic sh shit over it. Young and Ace and his crew remixed the classic Vanessa Carlton song, A Thousand Miles, and flipped it. Filming at a plush golf course, smoking cigars, all while dancing hey, to the video to celebrate the deaths of their rival crew, led by the rapper Fulio out of North Jacksonville. Who I Smoke went viral, hitting 16 million views in one month, and getting reactions from all the biggest influencers online. Please don't smoke. Say it. No! <laughs> hey, Fulio, come get this nigga before you play with your top. This is one of the most savage videos I've I've seen. Just, you know why? They show one gun in the video. But the way they seem to be just nonchalantly have like enjoying. Bro, how do I move chance, bro? I hate when you guys do chance in my shit, bro. Hey, Ak. Yo, Ak, say what's good to my stream, bro. Yo, what's good, stream? Yo, Ak. What up? What I you know what you gonna say. <laughs> what? Nah. Every time I hit, every time you say Ak, it feels like you about to ask the fuck or something like that, man. Ak, I have some cheeseburgers for you. Uh, wait, wait, what type though? Just, you know, extra double-double cheeseburgers. Your favorite. That, what brand, though? Man? I got six cheeseburgers for you. If they're from In-N-Out, we can fuck with it. In-N-Out, of course. Only In-N-Out. Yeah, okay. All right. All right, cool. I'm going to come pick them up. Uh, well, who are you with right now? I'm with uh, uh, Six Nines, like, crew. Six Nines crew? Yeah, yeah. He went to uh, change. We going to the club, low-key. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Um, okay. Well, I just want to check in. Um... Yeah. Yeah, wait, 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 it's all good. <laughs> Anyways, Ak, I'll fuck you later, okay? Mwah. Yo, you don't get the hell out of here. Ak, baby, fuck me. Chat, how big do you guys think Ak's dick is? It's probably like very small and fat. All right. In life? What clown of the niggas who died? So Fulio had to retaliate in a darker, more ominous way, remixing a classic Fantasia song and in the music right, video, so printing out a big poster of two of Ace's friends and his blood brother who died by Ace's side in a drive-by shooting outside a Japanese steakhouse. Ace was the only one in the car who survived. Since then, both Fulio's crew and Young and Ace's crew so just you this, song me shit. this song towards each other, leaving hidden messages in the music videos. Got kidnapped, they found his bones, he was right. Where's Corbin? Where is Corbin Johnson? The 18-year-old's parents say they dropped him off last week at a job interview. Uh, chat. Uh, Selena Powell, speaking of Selena Powell, she DM'd me. She said, I'd like to come on your stream. Uh, do you guys want Selena to come on stream?
All right, I'm gonna DM her and say fuck it. I'll show you guys proof. A lot of you guys think I lie about shit. Yeah, I literally see someone just say cap. So, uh, as you guys can see right there, Selena Powell. Can I come on your stream? I'm gonna say yeah. Mike! Mike! Are you okay? For real? Okay. Um. All right, I'm seeing a lot of yeses for Selena Powell. I I just damn they're saying yes. I got you guys. And they never saw him again. Left his house Wednesday night. Here's a picture of him behind us. And there's little in the way of clues as to where he might be. Corbin ass was lost until they found him in that bag. Oh. Fucking Christ. Oh my goodness, bro. I did not mean to even nod, bro. Fuck. Corbin Johnson was last seen alive in July of last year. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god, bro. Here, then last Friday, a man discovered the, the victim's skeletal remains. But what makes this situation real cold is some of the folks beefing are literal cousins. Blood relatives caught up on opposite ends of the feud. Yeah, now, that is your cousin. Nigga, fuck your cousin, man. That's your real cousin? That nigga cousin, I don't give a fuck about that nigga cousin. Now, we're getting into all this, but first I got my guy Millie's with Jim Jones for the song of the day today. This is Heightened Sense. The government keep it the list. Aye. In order to understand this story, we gotta go to the biggest city in the country in terms of land size. Chicago. It's not in Alaska, and that's Jacksonville, Florida. Florida's always had a huge presence in rap music, especially in the last two decades. But its biggest city, Jacksonville, never really got any mainstream success until now. And that's all because of these viral diss records between two crews. Young and Ace is the face of ATK Gang, which mostly occupies the west side of Jacksonville. His rival Fulio is the face of KTA, alias Kill Them All, which is an alliance between two groups, Fulio's gang from the north and Young and Reckless, a crew from the south side. What's worse about this beef is the amount of mutual friends both camps had at one point in time. Ace and Fulio were never exactly close, but they did have mutual friends such as Queso, who right now is locked up with his own father, charged for two murders, including the killing of Fulio's blood brother, Bibby. After Bibby's murder, Queso would notoriously walk around wearing Bibby jerseys, taking photos like it was a trophy. He even released an album in 2019, putting images of his dead ops as the cover, like a Mount Rushmore of fallen rivals. Jacksonville Police, or JSO, are notorious for not cracking cases. In fact, 70% of murders in the city go unsolved. So what? folks online came up with the catchphrase, JSO loves Queso, for the simple fact that he telegraphs what he's doing on social media. You see how I'm glad it? Come here, boy! Come here, boy! All of Queso's songs have millions of views on YouTube. YouTube, and he was actually very close with King Von. The two had music together, Queso even appeared in that infamous video where Quando Rondo and Von were joking around with each other back when they were on good terms. Dirty ass <laughs> Damn, wait, so chat, Quando, Quando and, um, Quando and Von were friends at a time? Like, how good of friends? Chad, shut the fuck up. I'm not actually gonna get her on my stream. Could you guys shut up, bro? Like, I'm literally not getting her on stream. On all my all my entire life, I'm not, bro. It was a troll. I just fuck with you guys. Not friends, but they were mutual. Okay. Why the fuck would I get her on my Twitch stream? After what she said to me on No Jumper. I'm just entertaining it, bro. I saw the poll. Like, could you guys shut the fuck up? Thank God, obviously, bro. On, on my entire mother and father's soul. I was never gonna get on my Twitch stream. I just put that on everything I love, bro. Thank God, thank God, thank God. Obviously, bro, like, what the fuck? It'd be funny, no, bro. I, on God, ever since that no jumper shit, why would I do that, bro? Anybody who disrespects me, bro, in any sort of way, they're never gonna get on my stream again. And that's just, or, just, in, 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 like, I'm never, bro, never. Like, on God, no. Queso was there as well. 
but back in Jacksonville, Queso had a well-known reputation. Hey, chat, where you guys all from, antics. by the way? Uh, um, what's it called? I, uh, what, I got a lie? No, 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 ever since, you know, the whole thing with, um, by the way, I'm from, I'm from Florida as well, chat. Ever since the whole thing with, you know, um, Blueface's artist, I'm just, yeah. Famously tried to organize a team deathmatch in real life with his own cousins, who rep the rival gang, KTA. What's up, where you at? Come on, I do a uh, team deathmatch. Right now? Yeah, I'll two words us too. Look at my cousins. They, we look alike. My cousins don't want to talk. He's trying to end <laughs> Wait, are they being for real? Why are they smiling? Wait, child, are they being dead ass? One of the cousins on that live was named Lil Nine. A month after that back and forth, Lil Nine was leaving a gas station when his car was ambushed. Shot 12 times from a rifle inside another car, sending him crashing into a rental wheel tire shop, where Lil Nine was pronounced dead at the scene. While folks at the tire store were trying to revive him, Lil Nine's friend who was in the crash with him was frantically walking around filming inside the store. Fuck niggas play. Play! Fuck niggas play! You fuck play, man! Of course, Queso responded with a video of his own, laughing. Get out! <laughs> Get out! Then Queso. What the fuck am I watching, bro? Queso's blood brother, also Lil Nine's cousin, would recreate Lil Nine's death video from the tire shop. Y'all fuck niggas play! Y'all fuck niggas play! Play! Yeah, 60 days later, Queso dropped a music video, and in it, we see him putting a photo of his own deceased cousin, Lil Nine, in the microwave. See, the crazy part is, everybody that's beefing, at one point in time, was cool. Queso met Young and Ace in the ninth grade, they've been friends ever since, but the rival Fulio likes to remind Queso that back in 2015, he was hanging with them, and even- Oh, shit. This is the craziest one I think we've ever watched yet. And had the nickname Six Block Queso for his affiliation with Fulio's gang, Six Block. Even Young and Ace admits he was a fan of Fulio's music before their beef really escalated, but a series of unfortunate events would draw lines in the sand. Neutrals had to pick sides quickly. At a block party in South Chad. This is crazy as fuck, bro. Jacksonville, it's in YNR territory, young and reckless. A crew led by YNR Mookie and his lieutenant, Slugger T. Ace and his gang show up to the party and get into an argument with YNR's leader, Mookie. Shots were fired and a bullet grazed Mookie's skin, with his lieutenant, Slugger T, shooting back. But Ace and his crew managed to escape the party, leaving Young and Reckless and Ace's crew on bad terms. On top of that, YNR's leader Mookie was already friends with Fulio's cousin. This made it easy for YNR and Fulio's gang to click up, creating an alliance under the name KTA, or Kill Them All, with one enemy in common, Young and Ace and ATK. The trends in Jacksonville at the time were not good. It was marking an increase in the murder rate year on year. In 2017, Ace would drop the song Go To War. This was an open invitation to anyone opposing ATK to retaliate. Not long after, Ace's home was shot up, but the tipping point was soon to come. A few months later, one of Ace's friends was out on a mission. Why do you guys spam robbery. Aiden after every single... He looks nothing like me, bro. YNR's leader, Mookie. Shots were fired and a bullet grazed Mookie's skin. We're gonna go back, yeah, I'm gonna... Slug He literally looks nothing like me, bro. Young and Ace and ATK. The trends in Jacksonville at the time were not good. It was marking an increase in the murder rate year on year. In 2017, Ace would drop the song Go to War. This was an open invitation to anyone opposing ATK to retaliate. Not long after, Ace's home was shot up but the tipping point was soon to come. A few months later, one of Ace's friends was out on a mission, looking to avenge a robbery that had happened to him. He knew exactly where the robber was on the west side of Jacksonville at Fulio's cousin's house. So he snuck into the house, throwing a brick through the sliding door, entering from the back where he began shooting. No mask, no gloves. He couldn't get who robbed him, and instead he ended up killing Fulio's cousin, Zion, and wounding a nine-year-old girl. 
If this was the start of a war, Damn, Zion's bro. death was the catalyst. Not long after, Zion's sister was shot 14 times in an attempt to prevent her from going to trial and testifying. She miraculously survived. Holy fuck! And young Anace's friend who did the shooting was sentenced to life. But things were just getting started. Fulio's cousin being the first death in the beef meant KTA were looking to get revenge swiftly. They needed to make an example. Ace's music was starting to pick up steam. His new song, F That, was getting millions of views on Worldstar in mere days. Fans were already comparing him to Youngboy. Then a week later, this happened. Four young men were in this car when they were shot. Hold on, chat. Hold on. This is, this is fucking crazy. Give me one second, chat. Please. Bro, I'm, bro, chat. Fucking, what's it called, bro? Um, why are you guys saying oh boyfriend? Why? I'm literally, t I was talking to, I'm literally talking to fucking Pammy in there. Why are you guys saying oh boyfriend? Y'all are fucking weird as fuck, bro. She's literally showering in there right now. I just went to go say hi to her. Oh boyfriend. All right, bro, I'm ending my stream. I'm actually out of my stream. You guys are fucking weird as fuck. I'm gonna go shower my girl and go to sleep. I don't know why you guys are so fucking weird, but I'm just kidding. The vehicle pulled up to their Chevy sedan, opened fire, then took off. And one is in critical condition at the hospital. Keontae Bullard, the only survivor of the quadruple shooting. It's a Tuesday in June of 2018. Ace, his brother, and two friends were going to Wasabi, a Japanese steakhouse, for Ace's friend's 18th birthday. Everyone was in good spirits, taking photos. It was a celebration. But little did they know, the whole time, they were under surveillance. Rivals had found out their location because of Ace's Instagram story, taking photos outside the steakhouse. Damn. Ace even recorded his friends eating inside the restaurant and posted that too. So their enemies waited outside, watching them eat, then followed them leaving the restaurant, driving along the highway. Wait, Chad, do you guys think that these rappers, um... Chad, do you guys think that these these rappers like stay like in the uh, in the same hood? I seen that one. That story of Kate, you know, that shit's crazy. Anyway, when they got to a red light, the shooters opened fire on the passenger side of Ace's car, killing his two best friends and his brother, leaving Ace in critical condition. It was a quadruple shooting, and Fulio got the news before anyone else did. Except he thought Ace was dead. <laughs> the boy lost the Fortnite match. <laughs> Till coming up, man. Cold summer alert, man. Two, three pack, man. Ace pack, bitch. Of course, Ace survived, but he lost everything. His brother and his two best friends. The attention, however, was helping grow his career. NBA Youngboy would FaceTime him to record a song, and it also motivated Ace to make his biggest record ever called Pain, which went viral and as we speak has 50 million views on YouTube. But the blood spilling was not over. Every time Ace would drop a song, his rival YNR Mookie would use the same song titles to make a diss track. The Jacksonville police even created a whole new department called the Violence Reduction Strategy Team, whose whole job was to basically comb through music videos from both camps looking for clues. The assistant chief even said in an interview, I don't think their primary goal is to entertain, but they are making real rap music. And at the top of the next year, in February 2019, Fulio's little brother Bibi was the next target for assassination. 
Bibby was just 16 at the time, and he was coming home from school one day in his own neighborhood on the north side of Jacksonville at what? the Hilltop Apartments. He was sitting on a gazebo in the courtyard of his complex with a friend. The two were looking at their phones when all of a sudden, pounding gunfire erupted. Bibby and his friend dropped the phone and jumped. Both started running in different directions, frantically looking for cover. A total of 60 rounds were shot in under 15 seconds. Bibby was killed instantly. A year later, when the court documents were unsealed, the police named Queso as the gunman responsible for Bibby's murder, saying that they drove for hours, circling the complex. What is this beef even- chat? What is this beef even fucking like? How does it start? Is it because like they're from different like neighborhoods? Like I don't understand. How does it even start though? Because there was a picture of them all being cool in 2015 he just said parking, waiting, until finally springing out and unleashing Draco rounds in Bibby's direction. Then Queso allegedly walked up to Bibby, who was on the ground, shielding himself from the gunfire, and executed him at close range, before fleeing the apartment complex in a gray knee. This is all fucked. The court documents also mention Queso's affinity for wearing Bibby jerseys, and posting it to his IG page in celebration. Wow. Queso's bond is currently set at $4 million. For Fulio, losing his brother and his cousin in a short period of time was devastating. But 2019 was also the year his music was going to the next level. A million views, back to back to back consistently. And he was doing it all independent. Fulio was a big deal in Florida, but not quite big enough to be touring the country on his own. Unlike his rival Young and Ace, who was booking shows in multiple states. Just a month after Fulio's brother died, Ace was performing at a nightclub in Waycross, Georgia. Him and his crew went back to the hotel to relax by the pool when they were suddenly ambushed. An SUV pulled up and a group of guys hopped out shooting. Queso was there and didn't hesitate for one second to shoot back. One of Queso's boys, Rallo, died at the pool in- Wait, 60k? Nah, I'm, I'm at 59. I think the subs went down, chat. I'm at, uh, 59,330 again. Fuck. If I hit 60,000 subs, I'll do a, a hot tub stream. If you guys are new to my stream, please hit that follow button. It's literally free. Just tap the screen, hit the follow button. Uh, here it says the subs right here, 59.3k. If you guys got Amazon Prime, thank you so much, Dex Mojo with the Twitch Prime, ST. Anyone subbing up? Appreciate you guys so fucking much, bro. We're right at 60k. Appreciate everyone subbing up and following. In that shootout. Only Ace's side got arrested This for is crazy, back. bro. The other gunmen were never found by police. Queso would say the quiet part out loud in his song, Been Dead, where the lyrics go, Should've killed me in Waycross, they hopped out with the K's. Me and Scotty bussin' back, we were on the same page. That's the same music no video way, with his cousin bro. 09 in the microwave. A month after dropping this song, Queso was arrested for a whole different murder alongside his father, who was charged with accessory after the fact. Allegedly, they were getting revenge on a rival rapper named KTA Lil Buck. Damn, so his dad, bro, so this is this guy's dad, bro, and he's in jail for the same shit he's in jail for. They're both in jail for murder cases, so that's fucking crazy. He was born into this shit, bro. This is all crazy as fuck to me, bro. See, I'm not about this life at all, bro. On God, I'm not. Um, this is fucking crazy the fact. Allegedly, they were getting revenge on a rival rapper named KTA Lil Buck, who dissed Queso's older brother that died in a van full of Queso's relatives when two cars rolled up, blocking them off, and put a hundred bullets inside the car. Lil Buck was Fulio's close friend and a high-priced target that ATK got oh, the drop yeah, on, allegedly rolling up at 11 in the morning while he was applying for a job to assassinate him. Queso posted to his Insta story right after, saying, I kill a dude, then get my toes done. Receiving a pedicure with the caption, kill a N-word, then go get my toes done. This <laughs> wasn't the way the reporter said that, but bro, what the fuck? Chat, my bad, one more, one more thing, I just gotta really go check. I gotta go say one more thing to my girl. She's not feeling too well. It's like, one second. This is fucking crazy. Hey. I can't. I can't. I 
I gotta go back to the stream. No, 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 no. I miss you. I will. I can't go in, bro. I because I have to stream. Yes, but I can't. Can we take, can we take another one? Like, when I'm done? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, can we? How you feeling? You feel good? I feel like that, but okay. I feel better. Okay, good. Alright. Are you hungry? I'm gonna order food. Go in, go in. Bro, I can't, bro. You guys want me to literally end stream and go in? You guys are so weird. <sighs> if he doesn't get in, he's gay on God. Like, bro, okay, do a poll right now if I should, if I should get in. Pause your stream to get in. No, I really want to get in, but like, I got, I can't. All right, like, can we finish this video? Wasn't the first hit done outside a job site. Another rapper, Jump Out, who beefed with Young and Ace and ATK, was killed while we. Wait, you said pause stream and just go hop in. Damn, you guys really want me to go get in. You stink. You can't smell me though. Go on IG live. Play a video and go in. <laughs> Waiting in Bruh. line to apply for a job at an Amazon warehouse. Leading to the infamous line on who I smoke, where they say, found out where he was working Jesus and clocked him Christ, out. Bro. The war had escalated to a point where, no matter where they were, no matter who it was, one side was shooting at the other, and the other would shoot back. We can count a dozen of Fulio's friends who are locked up, and YNR Mookie, and Slugga T are behind bars too. Even Fulio's girlfriend got shot in the head. Y'all thought I was dead. Y'all ain't underscore so this yet, boy. And to this day, this Young and Ace crazy, still has bro. a bullet casing in his butt from the quadruple shooting outside the Wasabi Steakhouse. That's it for this video. Let me know what you want me to cover in the comments below, and I will see you in the next one. I want to go in the shower. Oh, the real chat. How about this? We can put. Wait, I didn't know he made one about Pusha T. Did we even watch? Yo, chat. Did we watch the Pusha T one? We didn't even watch the Pusha T one. I don't think. Aiden, you're literally gay if you don't get in, bro. I don't want to shower with her, bro. I don't want to shower with her. I don't want to shower. No, we did not watch the Pusha T one. No, we didn't. How does it make me gay? I don't want to shower with her. I'm literally kidding. Obviously, I do want to shower with her, but like, you guys are gonna be so weird. I gotta keep it so 100. I ain't never like you, good. Hold on. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't never like you. Let me go see how hot the shower is. If it's hot. Baby.
not smell. Huh? Here you go. I know you do. Go in or you're gay. Like bro, let me call Rage. Are we playing Mimic or not, bro? <laughs> he said put our video on and go in. Bro, I don't want to, bro. Because then I'm going to be an L streamer. You know what I mean? That's how it always is, bro. I can never win. Go in or you gift 20 subs. <laughs> Yo, are we, are we, I'm streaming. Are we playing? Yeah, I'll play whenever you're down. I want to play Mimic now. Let's do it. Now. Like 30 minutes? What do you think? I'm playing 30. Josh, baby, dick me down. Chill out, I bet. No, when? I get on like 30, so I shit. I get on 12 my time. So whatever that is. So 30 minutes? Yeah, 30 minutes. Alright. Uh, my boy. Wait, 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 don't hang up yet. Let me just make sure that uh everybody else is ready. What are you doing? Nah, flights flights live, but I wanna make sure that you know. What you doing? Nothing. Why did I thought you were just jacking your dick? I wasn't. Fuck, I want to go with my girlfriend right now. She's in the shower. What are you doing with the camera? Why is it shaking? <laughs> it's nothing. <laughs> I'm smacking my leg. Who the fuck are you, who are you adding to the call? Who's that? It's Royce. Bro, oh my god, I want to go in there, bro. Fuck. Oh, hold on. In the street, like, like we ain't gonna talk about that on here though. When I was hustling, I was playing Memphis rappers. I felt like they had such an underground scene. That's what I that's what I gravitated to, like the most gutter music is what I want to hear. Police and prosecutors say Pooh Shiesty was part of the group that ended up in this parking lot that October afternoon where the shots flew, and it happened right across the street from the police department and town hall here in Bay Harbor Islands. All right, what's up, everybody? Probably the most requested artist for me to make a video on right now is Pooh Shiesty. It's one of the biggest movements in rap, and it's coming out of Memphis. But for a lot of folks, it feels like he came out of nowhere. Last week, Shiesty was second only to Drake for the most streamed artist in the country. And there's a reason everyone's drawn to him. Pooh Shiesty's crew, Chopper Gang's gotta be one of the wildest in the industry and the music reflects it. Doesn't matter how many billboards all over the country have his face on it. Doesn't matter he's signed to a major label deal with Gucci and Atlantic selling 60k the first week on his debut album. Shiesty will still rob a dude in Miami who was trying to sell him weed and some Jordans, stick two shooters on the guy, sending him to the hospital, escape in a green McLaren, get arrested, bond out, and leave the state in a private jet. Saying the two left the state in a private jet. Who, they got the right guy? See, Shiesty keeps his circle small. You basically gotta give your life to Chopper Gang just to be around. Chopper Gang Hank, he's locked up for an attempt murder, allegedly shot up a car and paralyzed the dude in a bad case of mistaken identity. Chopper Wap, he's down for a murder and two attempts. Even Shiesty's best bro, Big 30, who was signed to a deal way before Shiesty was, getting tens of millions of streams a month, he got booked two weeks before Shiesty did on felony drug charges in Alabama, got extradited back to Memphis for another pending case he was already fighting, made bond, and released the song first day out. But most of the mainstream was not tuned in until Lil Durk and Shiesty came together to make the song Back in Blood. And while most fans were focused on Dirk in the wake of the Quando and Vaughn situation, the entire city of Memphis was focused on Shiesty's verse. Because he wasn't just rapping, Shiesty was talking about a specific event that happened where he and two members of his crew went to a rival house in Memphis and robbed a bunch of guns from them. That's why in the lyrics he says, yeah you know who took that shit from you, come get it back in blood. On the song, Shiesty's talking directly to them. We ain't mad, Scott. We want you to see this face. You nigga know who or what did that to y'all. You nigga know. 
The rival gangs called EBG and them and Shiesty have had problems for many years locally in Memphis. EBG being from the north, Shiesty being from the south, it plays into this divide that's not existed in the city. But now the Back in Blood song is worldwide, hitting the number 8 spot on Billboard charts, getting 50 million views on YouTube in one month, forcing EBG, who aren't even rappers, to respond over the same Back in Blood. Yo, chat, chat. Um, do I have permission to get in the shower? Like, I, I, will you guys wait? Will you guys honestly wait? Yes? All right, all right, bet. I'm going in right now. Blood beat. Their remix got taken down a bunch of times, each time getting hundreds of thousands of views in days. So EBG dropped the second diss track. This one called Rumors. They even got Quando Rondo to make an appearance, taking collateral shots at Dirk just for being on the original song with Shiesty. Now, we're gonna get into all this, but first, check out my song of the day. This is some motivation from my guy K Johnny. Let's go. To the point, I don't give a fuck no more. Just thought I should fucking miss him. I done fucked around and got my heart broke, but I done buried all of my feelings. I know my mama saying, go get it. You got a child that needs visions. So I can shit on him, I did it. I hate to do it, but I did it. Look, I cannot visit my past. I'm back in my bag. No more being stupid. The love I had, get on one bag. I'm talking again. Let's get to the moolah. Look, I'm throwing this shit in the trash. I manifest cash. You thought I was ruined? I know you fucking thought I was ruined. I'm getting great. Right now, Memphis is like the gold rush for artists. Everybody's getting signed. And the reason is, Memphis has one of the rawest, most authentic cultures. But there's a lot more to it than good music and good barbecue. Memphis is the heart of the Bible Belt, with more churches than gas stations. On one hand, it's that southern hospitality, home of friendly folks who work hard to get by, but on the other hand, it's extreme violence, making Memphis the third most dangerous city in America. It's rural country, so practically everybody's tooled up, and folks have paramilitary weapons. In areas like the South or North Memphis, your life expectancy is 20 years shorter than other parts of the city. Right now, in some neighborhoods in Memphis, families are sleeping on the floor to avoid being hit by gunfire from outside. For some, they live in a war zone. For Pusheisty, he's from the Cane Creek Apartments in South Memphis, just 15 minutes from Moneybag Yo's hood, the Walker Homes, not far from Young Dolph's neighborhood in Castalia, and black youngsters around the way too. Pusheisty growing up was very much on that killer be killed energy. Let his boy Big 30 tell you, at age 11, Shiesty thought he was American gangster. Getting arrested and expelled from middle school at the same time, forced to wear an ankle monitor. See, Shiesty followed in his pop's footsteps. Pooh's father was a known gangster and founder of the record label Mob Ties. In 2006, one of his artists, who went by the name Miscellaneous, got into a triple shooting at Yo Gotti's birthday bash. The club managers knew that Yo Gotti and Miscellaneous were beefing, and instead of canceling the event, they hired 35 security guards using four metal detectors to screen the crowd. It didn't work. That same year, Shiesty's father was convicted of being an accessory in the murder of a local female DJ, which put him on supervised parole. Even with the law breathing down his neck, his pops was still hustling for almost a year, bringing in money under the radar from a trap house on a street called Porter. The house fell on a dead end and looked like it had been abandoned. But little did Pooh's father know, Memphis police had been monitoring the spot for months. One day, his father was in there. They had the measuring cups by the stove, the digital scales on the kitchen counter, one of them had weed, the other had cocaine. Suddenly there was a loud boom as the front door busted open and cops bursted in, rushing apartment three that was just up the stairs. As the cops ran up, this 75 pound pit bull came sprinting around the corner and leaped at their necks. So the officers shot it three times before the dog retreated to the kitchen and later died. In the chaos, you could hear yelling, go, 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 as people ran from apartment three to apartment four, trying to escape. Glass shattered as folks jumped out the window, leaving Pooh's father in the kitchen cornered by police. They told him to surrender, and he did, leaving the officers with 12.5 grams of coke, 8 pounds of kush, and $10,000 cash that they took from Pooh's father's left pocket. With his pops in and out doing fed bids, Shiesty was running around a badass little kid, jumping people, finessing people, that's how he got the name Shiesty. And Memphis is a small world, everybody knows each other, Shiesty even went to Central High School with some of the people he's into it with right now, like the main rapper from EBG, E. Jizzle. But Pooh's reputation began to travel, in high school he expanded his circle, clicking up on some plans to get money by any means. Together with his childhood friend Big 30 from Whitehaven, Little Hank, 
Antwop, and a few others, they came up with the name Chopper Gang, and it stuck. Chopper Gang shit. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. We ain't got a prop to crop back here. We prop prop be prop real, we, we, we slug and shit. Nigga ain't gonna die. We gonna call Chopper nigga whole block, street, whatever. Within Chopper Gang, they have various members that come from big sets that are prominent in the area. What a lot of people don't know, Memphis has every single national gang and more. It's extremely active. With this new trend towards hybrid gangs, smaller mobs, and cliques within the sets going renegade, warring with each other. To see where there was an older person running everything, but it's been changing a lot. And a lot of these young kids with these offset groups, they're totally different. More little uh, cliques or little gangs that seem to be particularly violent and need less and less of a reason. Uh, to resort to shooting the gun. One story of a guy named White Grape, or White Boy Kenny, who went to Central High School with Pooh Shiesty and them, and was known for having girls lined up like a buffet. He was a member of Chopper Gang who got initiated into the Grape Street Crips. They beat the shit out of him, took a photo that went viral as he became an official Grape Street member. But one day, White Grape allegedly got his gun robbed from him, so Chopper Gang had to cut ties with him, basically disowning him. Only for White Grape to catch a murder case months later, after a drug deal went wrong and clients tried to pay him with counterfeit money, so he shot and killed one of them. Now, Chopper Gang continued spreading their enterprise, planning bigger licks that brought more danger. Shiesty himself says before the age of 15, you're gonna lose a close friend in Memphis. Guaranteed someone close to you is gonna get killed. Around 2016, he lost his best friend Trey Day, which turned his heart cold. Pooh Shiesty vowed to live with no remorse from that day forward and be a menace to society. And after he graduated high school in 2018, Chopper Gang had many streams of income flowing in and they started using some of this money they were making to pay for studio time. It was one of those rare cases where the music blew up out the gate. They dropped their first song, Breaking News, near the end of 2018, and by 2019, they were buzzing. Shiesty's childhood friend Big 30 got signed to fellow Memphis artist Moneybag Yo. Meanwhile, Shiesty was still a free agent, dropping his singles every other week, racking in views. This caught the attention of Guwap, who was in the middle of building his 1017 roster, looking for the grimiest artist he could find. Of course, Guap was the original slime. You remember hearing stories of a young Gucci Mane terrorizing the industry. Famously, the first time he met French Montana to do a song together, French paid him $5,000 and waited in the studio patiently while Gucci took the money and left out the back door. Gucci didn't like French because the first time he went to the studio to do a song with him, he paid Gucci $5,000 to get on the feature. And he was just sitting in the studio, and Gucci was going out the back door. Yeah. Like, he wasn't yeah. doing nothing. Yeah. And I said, Gucci, you can't do no shit like that. And that's the same energy Gucci saw in Pooh Shiesty. After hearing one song on YouTube, he hit up Pooh on IG to get the paperwork ready for a major label deal with Atlantic. Chopper Gang was laughing to the bank, the industry fucked up and left some real gangsters in. Big Scar, who's also from South Memphis and just happens to be Pooh Shiesty's cousin, he's a founding member of a clique called Double R. There's been in a brutal war at home in Memphis for quite some time. And up until this point, Big Scar was strictly in the streets handling business and never really considered himself a rapper. Until one day, he actually blew up off a reaction video done by a YouTuber named Tommy Craze who reacted to Big Scar's first ever song when it had only five views in nine hours. How about Big Scar, make a play. Five views nine hours ago. Man, that was so hard. Definitely co-sign this track. Big Scar, make a play. Go and check it out. That song went on to do millions of views and two months later, after Shiesty became a major label artist and with only two songs ever published, his cousin Big Scar inked a deal with Gucci, making Chopper Gang in their affiliates the single biggest movement coming out of the mid-south and with all this attention on memphis it brought more drama to the city push was living up to his name and began taking shots at another memphis rapper named big boogie you at big boogie the bugster where you at <laughs> hey boogie, hey red Ron, i would get out there in the street with your gang me by myself the whole gang right now right now today in like 30 minutes on live all this shit why you say something back cuz 
you did that out of your fans, cuz. You let your fans boot your head up, cuz. Yeah. Yo, you done cost yourself. You got shows and shit ahead of you, bro. Boogie's a rising artist out of Frazier, which is the North North super country part of Memphis. Seems like a good guy. According to Boogie, they never met a day in their life, but Shiesty claims when he pulled up in the North to see Boogie, it was a whole different story. Oh, you been running from me, bro. You been running. You been running from me, bro. You know what happened in the North, bro, when I pulled up, came on your side, bro. You know what happened. And Pooh is so petty, he even went as far as naming a strain of weed, Red Rum, after Big Boogie's crew, Red Rum, just so he could say that he's smoking on that Red Rum pack. And the bigger you get, the bigger the target you become in Memphis. Just a few days after he went back and forth with Shiesty on social media, Big Boogie's concert in Mississippi got shot up. It was the scene of a double murder. 50 shots in total were fired from five different guns, hitting Big Boogie's friend Jasmine, who was on stage with him, and she later died in Boogie's arms. Fast forward a few months later to November 6th. Dirk and Pooh Shiesty linked up to drop the audio for the song Back in Blood. That's the same day where King Vaughn passed away in Atlanta after an altercation with Quando Rondo outside the Monaco Hookah Lounge. Shiesty and Dirk had already filmed the music video back in Chicago, but chose not to release it yet. This was, in many ways, the mainstream's introduction to Pooh Shiesty. A few more weeks went by and the song continued to climb the charts. Then randomly, at 6 in the morning on a Tuesday in December, Shiesty posts this cryptic warning to Facebook. Drop that song and you're not gonna live to see that baby get here. That's when New Year's came around. January 1st, 2021. A Memphis crew called EBG put out a remix to Back in Blood going after Shiesty, responding to everything he said on the original track. They got Choppa Gang Killer CGK on their t-shirts. Pooh responded immediately, saying this had to be the worst move this gang ever made. And that he did 18 million views off of them before he even said their name. The very next day, Shiesty dropped the music video that he filmed with Dirk back in Chicago, making Back in Blood the trending topic once again, shooting all the way up the Billboard rankings. EBG's remix was getting taken down left and right due to copyrights, so EBG's main rapper E. Jizzle dropped another diss track called Rumors, which ran up in views quickly, hitting a million views in less than a week. Then Jizzle was shot three times just days after this second diss track went live. I bet a dad can do this. Ah, <laughs> can do this. <laughs> Who this is? Who? Who? I can't walk. I can't walk. <laughs> Three bullets hit his arm, and after getting them removed, Jizzle was back on the block wearing a cast, just in time to drop his third diss track called Paralyzed. To add to the unfortunate timing, Pusha Isti's brother, who had been on life support fighting for every breath, was pronounced dead just hours before EBG released this new diss. As it stands, the song has nearly 400,000 views in a week. EBG Jizzle went from a couple thousand followers to 50,000 almost overnight. And Memphis has pretty much been in a frenzy ever since. But yeah man, let me know if there's a video you want me to cover in the comments below. I will see you in the next one. I had a uh, mixtape called it one month. At that time, I was trying to get a deal. I was, I felt like I was this close to getting a deal with somebody, just because my music was good and I, I had like a little bit of connection to the industry. But I also, I had just graduated college. I was broke, nigga. I was like struggling to pay my rent. I had no job, and I was kind of being complacent because I had crazy music, and I was kind of chilling, like as if that was good enough to get me to where I needed to go. And I had a realization. One time, nigga, I'm in a party. I'm drunk and I'm high. So I had to leave the party and go to the backyard. What? So I'm back there paranoid, like, oh my God, like, nigga, I'm going through it. Shit. Nigga, life is on me, nigga, rent. All my college friends went and got jobs. Nigga, I'm over here doing some rap shit. And these niggas walk in the backyard to come find me. They're like, yo, we want to holler at you right quick. Bro, it turned into an intervention. These niggas was like, hey, bro, what you doing? You say you want to do this music shit. But like, all you doing is really just like hanging out, partying and shit. Mind you, one part of me is like, nigga, y'all, I'll be with y'all niggas. Like, the fuck are you talking about? But when they was talking, bro, I swear to God, I sobered up quickly. It was almost like I was on the stage. 
Nigga, literally after that, I thought about basketball. Why I ain't making the basketball? Nigga, I love to play. And at this point, I'm 21 years old, you know what I mean, 22. And I'm like, nigga, why you didn't make it in basketball? Because you wasn't fucking working. You thought you'd be outside dribbling the fuck. What was the, wait, when you guys made predictions? <laughs> nah, you're all weird for saying last and quick, but nah, you're weird. You're weird, you're weird. You're all so weird. Hey man, W's in the fucking chat, man. W chat too. I love you motherfuckers for that, bro. I needed that. Now I'm more hyped than ever. <sighs> I'm all fresh and clean. Yes, sir. W chat. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You guys are the reason. Yes, sir. W chat, man. Now I'm all clean and shit. I did rock the same shorts, though. I swear I'm, I have different underwear now. On, on God, I have different underwear. Uh, <laughs> bro, that was not quick, bro. ball doing something when really niggas was in the gym with trainers like putting in work shooting a thousand w cole hey chat was that actually fast well oh shit just saw cuffs text that's a day and your dumb ass over there thinking you doing something mimicking iverson yeah. so it was like yo do you really want to look back hey whammy in the chat for letting me uh you know uh Chad, what is your, what's the best chips, bro? Talk is the best chips. If you don't say that, you're automatically an L. Anyways, bro. I feel so good now, bro. 10, 20 years from now with this music shit and be like, the reason you didn't make it in music because you ain't- Jay Money ain't gonna get this up, motherfucker. Like, Fuck it. That was the where the warm up came from. Every day, nigga, I woke up, uh, wrote verses, made beats. So- and, and so all that to say, the off season was like the same concept. Like right. one more time before I leave, like before I feel like I'm like, like fulfilled in this game, let me try to reach new heights from a skill level standpoint. Remember I told you about the seven minute drill? Mm -hmm. Like I put myself through drills. I really try to work on my craft to like just reach new heights and push myself. So that's why I call it the off season. I know that was a long answer, but shit, nigga. Nah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll play you the, uh, the third joint. That's crazy. All right, new video. Y'all don't fuck with this video? Um, no. Chat, y'all wanna watch this video, yes or no? Just say yes or no. Are you just? Alright, bet. Chat, scare game in 10 minutes. So after my IQ test, we'll play the scare game. Prissy, just give it to me on Discord right now. What's the site of the IQ test, though? Hey, chat. If you're new to the stream, hit that follow button right fucking now. If you guys got Amazon Prime, Twitch Prime, all those blue crowns right here, Shake Shack with the five. Get this up. Everyone put dubs in the chat right now. <clears throat> Why do you chew so loud? My teeth, bro. Hey, J Mo, is it a fight? Get that. It's been a fight against comfort. I was chilling. What I noticed was with that feeling of comfort, I'm like, damn, this is the moment that a lot of your favorite rappers hit a crossroad where they did what the fuck they set out to do. New bed? All right, back, fine. Anything else you guys want me to react to? Bro, wait, hold on a second. Do you remember when, you know, it's the craziest part of the universe again? 
I muted. You I muted. already know, I think. But you can't say it. I can't say it? That's not on you. I'll just say it. Somebody I had pre previously associated with um, commented on one of her TikToks. Yo, Dylan, they said a five, give the subs, bro. A lot of y'all have seen it. A long time They're ago. They're the ones that tag me. In that Isn't that fucking crazy? In one of my though? viral TikToks, it's actually really sad. Okay. Nah, but you know, I got no problems with that person. You know, it's all it's all love. It's all it's all good. Pay me. Pay me. Nah, J Money. We're currently at 59.4 thousand subs. Not edge, Dave. <laughs> Alright. What's the best IQ test to take? Alright, here we go. Hey, change that title to IQ test, please. Alright. I'm going to tell you guys straight up. Mods do predictions. Chat. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get above it 100 IQ. Alright. Here we go. It's time that now I just restarted, you stupid fuck. All right, here we go. Left, right, down, right. Left, right, down, right. Left, right. There's no down, right option, though. Fuck. Hey, I'm also thanks for the 10 of the subs. Hey, chat, I can't cheat, bro. Boss, go email only. Go email only. D, I know it's D, but you guys can't cheat, bro. All right. I'm done eating. I got to lock in. <clears throat> All right. Arrow, star, right, uncolor. Down, color. Left, uncolor. So this next one has to be uncolored. Oh my god. It's gotta be, it's gotta be, I can't look at my phone. It's gotta be down, man. Or no, it has to be up. No, down. Yeah, down. Up triangle, right triangle, down, left. Up triangle, right triangle, down triangle, left triangle, up triangle. Up, okay, so right, up, left. Up, tilt, down, down, right. This has to be left. Has to be. Big square, small square. Small square, circle. Square, square. Uncolored square, uncolored circle. Square, square. The next one has to be uh, uncolored squares. It has to be uncolored for sure. So it's a pattern. So it goes color, uncolor, color, uncolor, uncolor, color. Er. Uh, 
This one has to be this one. Circle, bottom left, circle. All right. My bad, guys. Bottom left, bo top right, bottom left. This one is going to be very fucking hard. Hey, Guapo with the 50 gifted subs. Everyone put dubs in the fucking chat right now, bro, for Guapo. Thank you so fucking much. From the bottom of my heart, Guapo, thank you so fucking much. All right, here we go. Guys, let me lock the fuck in, please. Circle. Right. Oh, it's so alternate. This next one has to be right here. It's B. Because look. Look, watch, chat, watch. I'm not, I mean, I'm explaining. You guys can't talk. But look, bottom left, then top right. Bottom left, then top right. Bottom left, then top right. Has to be this one. Circle, uncircle, circle, uncircle, circle. Uncircle. Now, which uncircle would it be? Circle, uncircle, circle, uncircle, uncircle, circle. Hi, baby. You look so good. Zia threw that shit at me. Hi. Take this IQ test. I gotta lock in. IQ test. Yeah. I don't know your IQ. I know. I, my IQ is gonna be crazy. I feel like. I'm gonna throw myself off. Crazy low or crazy high? High, high, high. Of course. Think high. What? I think it's gonna be high. I think it's gonna be really high. He looks so cute. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What? Come here. <laughs> you know what I mean? On camera. Okay. Well, let me lock in. I gotta lock in. You wanna sit down? No, I'm gonna go outside. You go outside? Inside. Oh, inside. Okay. I just wanna clean up a bit. Okay. Okay. You want some talkies? No. Can you actually get them away from me though? Fuck, this one's hard, bro. But it has to be one of these. Top or bottom line? How would you know? Top. Okay. That's easy. 24, obviously. 8, 16, 24. Um. Oh my god, Guapo with another 50 gifted subs. Everybody put W's in the chat. Guapo, thank you so much, bro. I really appreciate you. Um, we're about to hit 60,000 Twitch subs. It's fucking insane. Um, what's 60,000 times five? I'm gonna do that later. I'm gonna do it later. But that's a lot of fucking money. Um, yeah. Okay. That's crazy. That's actually insane. I love you guys. All right. This is going to be a really tough one. This one makes no fucking sense. Uh, I have 13 minutes left, and I'm on question number seven, I think. Eight? I got time. Um, so we have A right here. It's. It has to be... Uh, oh, I understand. It. I, it has to be either A or D, because the way the line is right here, it's very thin. Uh, fuck. I'm going to say it's A because the line is very thin right here and right here. Bacon, 28. Two bacon, 56. Three bacons. So not four bacons. That's three bacons. So the pattern is most likely timesing by two. Or each bacon is 28. So it's 28 plus 56. I don't think I'm allowed to use a calculator. But uh, what is 28 plus 56? Uh, five plus six, or five plus, okay, 56 plus 28. So, 50 plus 20 is 70. And, uh, fuck, 83, I think. This is a really hard one. I'm not good at math, really. Well, I am good at math, but it's just really fucking hard. Okay, so... We know it's it's got to be 80, right? 
it's it's not these two right here. It's a hundred percent one of these. Mm, man, that's a tough one. Uh, two evens, and this one's odd, so I gotta go with the odd number eighty-three. Got it, bro. What does that mean, bro? App too busy? What does that mean? Did you guys crash the fucking site, bro? Oh my god. What does that even mean, though, bro? Bro, L chat, bro. Hey, take it off email only, bro. L chat. I gotta hide the website now. How the fuck did you guys find this shit? Take it off email only, bro. L chat. Everyone spam L chat, bro. Like, come on. I was doing so good on that test. All right, let's find another one. I'm going to hide the website. I don't got to stop being so fucking weird, bro. I think you guys booted the website offline. <laughs> so weird. That website was perfect, though. It was 84, not 83. It was actually 83, buddy. Um, there was three pieces of bacon. Oh, here we go. I got, I got, I got another website. We're good. Perfect. I mean, time. It's like a similar one. All right. Um, oh, I don't want to show this shit. Let me sure I hide it because people are fucking weird. Like, imagine being a big enough of a yo lifer. Thanks for the ten gifted. I don't care if I'm hiding it or not, bro. All right. Fuck. I was in. I was taking such a good test, bro. This one has to be right here, I think. Circle. T go back to emote only, bro. Go back to emote only. 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 Stop cheating. Go back to emote only. Go back to emote only. Go back to emote only. Thank you. Okay. Let me lock the fuck in, bro, please. Circle, no circle. Circle, no circle. Circle, no circle. Damn, bro, that makes no sense. All these are two flooded circles. I gotta go with this one. They're all flooded right here. You gotta follow the fucking pattern. Um, two. Okay, this is actually really easy. Two right here are matching. That means two on each row match basically every time. They're contradicting each other. So this one has to be this one. It has to be. It literally has to be this one. Um, minus sign, equal sign. Equal sign, minus sign, equal sign, minus sign, minus sign, minus sign, minus sign. Has to be an equal sign. It's 100% equal. <sighs> If Jessica, if, if, Jessica, if Jessica, Elizabeth, and Stephanie are all in a room together and they shake hands with each other, how many total handshakes will occur? Okay, so Jessica, Elizabeth, and Stephanie have to shake hands, right? So Jessica shakes Elizabeth's hand. Jessica shakes Stephanie's hand. Elizabeth shakes Jessica's hand. Elizabeth shakes Stephanie's hand. Stephanie shakes Jessica's hand. And Stephanie Jake's shakes Elizabeth's hand. But with each other, right? So they can, mm, this is a trick question here. It's, it, I think it's six. Right? Damn, the chat can't tell me. That's the problem. Mm, I gotta go with six. If the population of an alien race doubles every two minutes, how long will it take for the population to grow from 1,000 to 32,000? Three, 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 All right, so 1,000 to 2,000. Wow, oh, wait, every two minutes... Uh, okay. So 2,000 is 2 minutes. 4,000 is 8 minutes. Uh, 8,000 is 16 minutes. Times, or it's 8. 8, 16, 24, 32, 4. Fuck, this is a tough one, bro. If the population of an alien race doubles every single 2 minutes, how long will it take for the population to go from 1,000 to 32,000? Okay, so again, if it's every two minutes and you have a 2,000 to 4,000 to 8,000, that's six minutes right there. Times two again is 
16. Oh, that's easy. It's 15 minutes. 11 lions, 4 cats, and 7 crows have a total of... Mm, okay. I, don't, I think lions technically have 2 tails. Because um, I'm not allowed to look it up, am I? Mm. Not, I don't know if it's a lion, but they have like a part of their tail and they have like this furry part. Yo, Emo, Emo Slayer, thanks for the 10 of the subs, bro. Everyone put dubs in the chat. Um, I'm just going to say they have one. I don't think they would try to trick us like that. So 11 lions, 11 tails. Four cats is 14 tails. Um, and seven, so that's 21. Ooh, it's not giving me that number. Uh... Hmm. That's really hard, actually. Hmm. Mm, that's really fucking tough, actually. Oof. I'm going to say it's 14. The price of an item was lowered by 25%. What percent must this discounted price be increased to go back to the original price? 25%. That's a try to trick question, but you're not going to trick me. That's easy, right? The price of an item was lowered by 25%. By what percent must this discounted price be increased to go back to the original price? Thirty percent, I think. Okay, so if I buy a T-shirt for twenty-five percent, no, 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 forty percent. See, I'm not really good at the math part. My part is more like real life situations. Choose the following next number in the following sentence. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Duh. Choose the following number in the next sentence. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Choose the next number in the following sentence. 1, 1, 2, 2, 3, 5. What? 1, 1, 2, 3, 5. What? This shit makes no fucking sense. One, one, two, three, five, five. Six. I don't know. Nobody knows what that is, though. That makes no fucking sense. Choose the next number in the following sequence. 20, 19, 17, 14, 10... Minus one, minus two, minus three, minus four, minus five, five. That's easy. Let's go. Square, um, circle. Okay, the circles get closer in. Then what happens? They got to go this way. So uh, it's going to be this one. Okay, so if you have a graph... And it's a question mark and a big graph. You're going to go with the big graph being mostly... No, the blue is on the outside, right? This is a tough one, bro. I can't even lie to you guys. This one right here is very tough. Oh, uh, fuck, bro. I really don't know. That makes no fucking sense. It has to be that one, though, because the blue is on the bottom. Okay. Square, circle, circle, circle. It's got to be another circle with this front form, you know? Oh, my God. These ones hurt my fucking brain, bro. All right, uh, let me think real quick. So you have a you have a, a a square on a square and a square and a square, square square. Fuck, bro. Oh, I see how it is. It's like a snake. It's 
got to go up this way. It's this one. <clears throat> the pattern ones are a little bit tricky. Level five. If you rearrange these letters, you get the name of a... Not lizard. Brazil. It's a city. Two of the four choices is the odd one out. Guess, seek, and query, demand. Oh, fuck, bro. I don't know. If you're guessing something, you're seeking something. So these two are, you're inquiring about something. Okay, so demand is the odd one out for sure. Hip, ankle, shoulder, bone. Duh. Hip, ankle, it's your hip to your ankle, your shoulder to your bone. What's the four choices of the odd one outs? Knife, fork, spoon, napkin. Napkin. Here we go. Here we go, chat. Let's see what we got. No fucking way. All right, bro. Don't make me pay for it, bro. Bro. Let's see if they email me. Here we go. You can take it off email only. You can take it off email only now. Let's see my results. I did click it, you dumbass bitch. A $2 fucking fine, bro. I'll pay $2, bro. $2. Somebody remind me to cancel this though, chat, because it says I gotta. Somebody remind me to fucking cancel it. Okay, here we go. My payment was su successful. Let's download my certificates. Oh, hey, I just took my IQ test. What'd you get? Let's see. You wanna see with me? I'm actually kind of scared for you. You're kind of scared for me. All right, let's see right here. It's downloading. All right, here we go. I'm opening it up right now. Yo, chat, if you're not already following me, bro, you guys already know you got to hit that follow button. If you guys got Amazon Prime, Twitch Prime, click subscribe right now. You get yourself free. Um, okay, I actually have a high IQ. What is that? I have a 96. What does that mean? I have a 96 IQ. It's like a high IQ. Uh, hold on, let me make sure it says it right. Here we go, chat. I have a 96 IQ score. It's very good, actually. It's like really good, actually. Are you sure? Pretty sure, yeah. Let me see right now. Why are you guys all playing LMAO? That's average, you idiots, bro. That's literally average. Watch. It's not good, it's average. Yeah, but I. But you gotta think, like, a lot of the questions they were asking was hard as fuck. Like, it, it actually makes no sense. It's school shit. It's really dumb. Um, let's see, what does a 96 IQ mean? Yeah, 90 and 109 are considered above average. A score of 116 or more is considered above average. That's what I have. Baby, Albert, I, I have the same IQ score as Albert Einstein. <laughs> no, you don't. Yes, I do. Look it up. Are you sure? Yes. My hair looks fucking weird as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, the other website was so much better. Hold on. It just there's so many people that are trying to access it, so it crashed. Ninety six. Ninety six. 
I'm not. A, I'm above average, though, right? Yeah, it's like a good average. Am I above average? No. You wouldn't say that. One hundred sixteen is above average. That's what I got. Okay, let me do one more. Select all the words with similar meaning as the one above. Big. Huge. Large. And colossal is, I think. Select all the words with a similar meaning as the one above. Uh, blame. Accuse. Vistify. And guilt, I guess. This is so fucking stupid, these tests. You are not gonna pass this. You are not gonna pass this. What do you mean? Because <laughs> I'm like dyslexic. What do you mean dyslexic? No, I'm not. I can I think read. You're dyslexic. Cold, um, freezing, chilly, nippy. Do you know what reluctant means? Reluctant? Yeah. No. Is it cold? It Does it mean cold? No. <laughs> what does reluctant mean? Doesn't mean. Huh? It doesn't mean cold. Oh, it doesn't? Stop. <laughs> Counter. Literally, none of these words mean short. Literally none of them mean short. None of them. I don't even understand half of them. Yeah, like what? Beginner, rookie, newcomer, I guess. This is so ass. This is this is actually pretty easy. It's just literally this split. I think you're smart. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. Already I played mimic after this. Alright, cool. It has to be with something pointing up. See this one it has to be this one. Flip. This one has to be pointing down-ish. Yeah, this one. Visual memory? Fuck. I'm not going with this shit. Fuck. Fuck. Two, one, two, 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 one. Fuck! I got this one. That's easy. This is a really hard test. Holy fuck. It's better to go bottom up. Like as many as possible that can be unscribbled to an English word. Um, fuck. This is hard, yes. Has. 
hill. Bat. Red. Fuck, this is so hard. No way it's gonna be harder than this. Late. Stay. No way I'm tripping. Fuck. Yo, fault. They still have five to get this over. Appreciate you. pronounce if I know that's a word. Same with this one. Teeth. Nope. Aaron's. Aaron, yeah. E-R-A-N. Pasta. Nope. Fuck. Fuck. This is so hard. Feed. Fuck. None of these are fucking words, bro. Dirty. Trade. Stale. Saints. Saint. Saint. That's easy. Select like the point close to the green points. What? Oh, this. Oh, I see how you do. You gotta do which one is perfect for all of them. Okay, so. Oh, I see. Alright, we're gonna play Mimic right now. This is kinda ass, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, fuck this shit. I'm playing Mimic. Point is, I have an above average IQ score. So. Almost at 60,000 Twitch subs, bro. You guys already know uh, what happens when we hit that 60,000 Twitch subs. Um, but uh, click subscribe right now if you guys have Amazon Prime, Twitch Prime. Um, yeah. Fuck. So ass, bro. Let me do this Discord shit real quick. Well, you said watch this video before. Up top can't drop down. The turtle dogs don't look around. It's just us now. Got a plane, Jane costs more than a bus down. I'm so different. I'm so fucking different. All right. Why are you cursing so Yo, hard? obey. They said the tank of the cells, bro. Bring your. I don't curse, bro. Yo, BCR. No, we saw this. We saw this for sure. Yo, obey. Thanks for the uh, tank of the bill.